Hello, hello. Yeah. One, two, five. One, two, yeah. three. Hello, hello. Yeah. One, two, five. Yeah. One, two, three. Hello, hello. Yeah. One, two, five. Oh, okay. I can hear. Okay. Actually. Okay. okay. Perfect. What happened? Chat, can 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 you guys hear Isaac? Can you guys hear me I... now? Yes, yes, they can hear you now. Okay, you they go. can hear me now. Okay, yeah, all right. Yeah. I think I figured it out. There um, we go. The audio guys is in charge of this stream, everyone. Hey, yeah, well, I'm not. I'm not the fucking OBS guy. Give me a second though, because I gotta. Yeah. I gotta mute these guys, or we. I gotta mute just for a minute. Uh, set all those on. All that's on. Web capture is on. Everything else is on. You guys should be uh, audible now. Okay. Yeah, I think. Sure. Okay. Okay. We're, yeah. We should. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Man. Can you guys uh, check uh, chat? Are you able to hear everyone? Yeah, I think they should be. I think most likely. Double check. Chat. I get to send my mouse onto the C Squad group this time, even if I'm a week behind. I wish you guys good luck. Kiwi, thank you so much. Appreciate you. You could have at oh least God, waited until we had our audio in order. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm really sorry about that, guys, but it should be uh, solid now. Guys, it's fine. It's the C Squad curse. It doesn't matter who we hand the stream off to. It's like they become like 50% less competent at least when it comes to this stream in particular. Hey, <laughs> hey now. <laughs> Hey now. <laughs> Both you, you to assume that we you to assume I'm normally more competent By the than way, I was streaming. Uh, so some of you guys um uh, uh sorry we couldn't catch up in the beginning. Um uh you might notice that things look a bit different. Yes. Uh and that is because uh for at least today potentially onwards I'll be the stream master guy. So I'll be in charge of doing the stream and I change the layout a little bit. And layouts will continue to change as the campaign goes on. Yeah, you know, just a little bit. It's almost unnoticeable. That it's it's barely You're... noticeable. Yeah, you, you, it's you, just yeah, you, can, you have to really notice it. Notice. You have to really mm -hmm. like focus and notice that it's uh, it's different from last week. Uh, does this mean we won't see funny Jerboa image anymore? Job. Okay, so actually, I gave Skorak the uh, the option to do funny Jerboa, so you can blame him. I don't, Skorak didn't want to be a funny Jerboa? He didn't yeah, want to be a funny Jerboa. I didn't, want to be a funny oh, Jerboa. I didn't want to be a frog. I am the, the least entertaining person alive. And, you know, you guys can, can, can blame me for that. <laughs> Chat protest. Oh, table. it's studio I want to see, see you outside of his place of employment with your fucking picket signs. <laughs> Bring Skorak is actually Skorak. It's jokes on you, my place of employment is my house. This is my job. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's an even it's an even bigger threat. Oh shit. <laughs> you would do it if it was a wolf. Oh uh, if it was a lupo version of me, yes. <laughs> but like, you know, we don't live in a perfect world. <laughs> You can say that again. You get a frog guy icon as well. That is true. I think if Skorak replaced himself with a frog guy, he would get more traction. <laughs> uh, are you you all right? Oh, I'm just looking at some stuff. I'm just looking at some stuff. I'm just looking at some stuff. I, don't like, uh, I, I told you, I told you, I nailed it when you first said anything. I was like, "Yeah, the dude makes like sounds." I was, I knew I was right. He he does make noises. That is true. He do make noises. I'll learn how to do transparencies later. I'm not going to worry about that on today's stream. Uh, fair enough, fair enough. Dragons IS4 bingo. Yeah, week I, by I week, to we're gonna like improve like by one step each week. Yeah, no, honestly, that's how it's gonna end up being. Um, oh one step. I got invited to the Lugman bingo, but I turned it down. Ara sends me fucking hey, yo, presets. Bro, I, I wanted to join the. 
I wanted to join that, the Langman bingo thing. Like, they, they invited me before making uh, applications public, but like, uh, it's yeah, at 1 a.m. It's at 1 a.m. and it ends at 7 a.m. my time. So I, I couldn't join. Oh, uh, I, 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 I declined because it's freaking, uh, what's it called? It's, I, I'm bad at IS4, so I was like, I don't know what I'm doing. Just to you don't even need to play. Like, as the content everyone, creator, you don't actually play. Just to remind you guys, make oh, sure you're in okay. uh, you're in heart or uh, roll twenty. I'll join, probably join next. Uh, Skorak, time. you yep. uh, is that the accurate background you want up? Uh, at this point, um, you know what? Let's leave that for a little bit, a bit later in the session. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm ready to to yeah. transition the scene over whenever you just let me know. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, before that. Uh, let's just do our, you know, usual introductions, get everyone up to speed. And you know what? Let's start with our new host, Isaac Wolf. Hmm? What's up? I'm Isaac Wolf, the music man, even though I haven't been doing that much fan stuff lately for Ark Knights. Uh, but I make official, unofficial OSTs in the community. You can check me out at uh, Isaac Wolf on YouTube, Spotify, and any other music platform. Uh, Glad you guys are here. I'll be playing. Um, I'm I'm playing Sebus Knowles, the Bard Man, even though I f I swear I play more like a rogue. <laughs> but yeah. Next off, next to me is uh. Let me see who is actually sitting next to me in this ordering. Uh, Blizzard, aka Living Rain. Hello, I'm I'm Living Rain. Um. Uh, I don't have a whole lot to say about my channel. I think it, I think it's pretty all right. You know, go check it out. Uh, I've got event summaries. I've got some top ten lists. You know, coming out relatively soon. I'm gonna I'm gonna be possibly dunking on Genshin Impact. You know, if anyone's interested in seeing whether I think it's worth a it's worth to play for a week. Uh, and I I'm Blizzard. I'm a bear and a motherfucking sorcerer. Uh. Motherfucking sorcerer. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really have. Hell yeah, I'm a motherfucking sorcerer. Worth the week thing is still happening. Don Laffy, it is still happening. The video is in production right now. I know it's months after that first like stream I did, but it's totally happening. It's it's the, my next video. It's gonna come out next. After that's probably the Sark has aren't victims or some. Agree to that with regards to the story. J but just actual my... Sarkaz propaganda, anti Sarkaz propaganda. Anti -sarkaz. No, it's anti Sarkaz truth. Anyways, no. next, right next to, I'm gonna pass it right next to me to everybody's favorite Blue Archive super fan, Karagi. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's me, Karagi, the cute and funny guy that makes uh, gotcha videos. Uh, Check out my latest video. It's uh, it's pretty funny. It's pretty cute. Uh, but yeah, I do funny stuff and Ark Knight stuff and just gotcha stuff in general. But yeah, I'm Kuroko. Uh, next off is Chaser. Ah, uh, my name is not important. Oh my god. The blackness of my soul <laughs> is only so matched good. by the vastness of my sorrow. Next to me, there's nobody. I'm used to being alone. I'm a lone wolf. I'm the alpha <laughs> in this group, you see. <laughs> oh my god. Sometimes people refer to me as a sigma, but that's a wrong nomenclature because I'm an alpha. And uh, I'm gonna play somebody that's just the opposite of all that. Just like the complete opposite. Yeah, yeah, like, like happy puppy boy. Who's, yeah, like, just so happy, happy to, like, golden retriever boy. That, that's who I'll be playing. We need to have like the <laughs> Spanish guitars playing as you're saying all this, the flamenco. Yeah. Yeah, Chase had watched the Too Many Tate podcast. So, you know, those alpha main yeah. podcasts? Oh. Where, like, they yeah. bring a oh, woman no. guest. So, they bring a woman guest and they just don't let yes. her talk at all. Just like, yeah, to just, just like cut her off and dunk on her for four years. Yeah. And anytime she starts speaking, they just immediately cut her off and be like, well, actually, shut up. You don't know what you're talking uh, about. You know, I do. Shut up, dumbass woman. Fuck you. Wow. <laughs> Such fucking creatures. Misogyny.
Uh, all right. Yeah, throw me that's our, our, the the and I'll come back and find that. <laughs> that's our ragtag group for today, oh. and obviously our amazing DM slash GM Skorak. Why, hello everyone. Name's Skorak. I am the person that will be uh, coordinating this drag type group of people. Uh, I do this, the Harmasis, you know, we're uh, bringing people together to do D&D and, uh, you know, learn the joy and um, this immense scuff of tabletop games. Uh, I also, along with Isaac, do Art Nights Abridged. Go check that out. It's really funny. It's really nice. Uh, I have a personal channel, but I don't really do much there. If I ever start doing stuff there again, I will, you know, announce nah, it. Nah, you're a D&D um, YouTuber now. Deal with it. At this point, I'm kind of a D&D YouTuber. <laughs> um, and I will be playing God, you know, as you do. <laughs> Skorak, if 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 you are if you are our GM, our, our our general manager, can I can I request a trade? Okay, what's the trade you request? <laughs> um, well, I think personally, uh, there's there's some. Uh, I I think personally, we we need to acquire some some new talent. I think uh, I I think okay. Karagi is is a bit too old. I think his contract is too bloated. I think oh, we, you, we you have think to look at a free agency. Oh, he's the market. Yeah. 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 yeah, sadly, so for him, I am the new Kuragi. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm just saying, like, like, I, like, Kuragi just isn't putting butts in seats. His scoring has gone down. I, I think we have to. I think ah, we have to trade for yeah. Kuragi. Oh, yeah, Kuragi, yeah. I don't know. Your, your ratings aren't really that good anymore, man. <laughs> oh, don't worry. He has yeah, strange pull with the blue archive fan yeah, base. And, uh, yeah, I think we need someone younger, yeah, and for that we can just look among the Kuragi's love interests. So. No, 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 I mean, no. Wow. Bro. After that, we can look in Kuragi's basement. <laughs> um, More like right. into my hard drive. All Jesus right. Christ. Okay. Um, With that out of the way, we can actually start the game. <laughs> the thing we all came uh, here to do. Remember? Shall I transition okay. it over? I think at this particular point, unless you guys want to talk about anything else before we start, we can transition it over. Got it. Yeah, well, Almost what about the uh, social economical uh, situation uh, in America? Well, Let's, I don't I want to talk about it. I, I have much to say. Yeah, the, 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 the only yeah. thing that I have much to say is. Supa, I can't wait for the for the full game of Escape the Backrooms where we're gonna have to go through all of it again. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, honestly, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna to happen that. when it comes out. It's gonna happen when it comes out. We're gonna have to go back. Damn, I, I see, I, I'm not, I'm not, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make the game too easy, so, so don't, don't, don't make uh, me go there again. Yeah, oh, you're like easy mode. You'll, you'll, you'll be there sometimes, but me and Supa are, have been there like every time. There's yeah, only I only missed the one time. Only one oh, time. Yeah. Because I, I had to go to, to a uh, fucking doctor. I need to ask chat, um, are audio levels good this week? Is everyone, like, pretty evenly loud? Since I actually personally did the mixing. Is yes, everyone remember, good? If we are not, you, you all have, like, free free ticket to just, like, blame, blame yeah. Isaac for that. Yeah, you, you, get, uh, <laughs> you get the free ticket to um to just rag on me. You know, I'm yeah, everyone is clear UI. and nice. Haha, -ha, fuck you guys. <laughs> I'm looking and at the also, UI. Why am I special? Shouldn't I be a. I, I, I was. I would you fuck you guys. Better. I was never shit. You, I, I'm not involved uh, you're in that. You're a specialist. So you like uh, some. Okay, okay. Too, all right. You know, oh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to transition this over real quick. <laughs> I'm an artificer, not a. Not a. Not a. Yes, yeah, <laughs> the closest thing to artificer. Yeah, uh, specialist yeah. is the closest thing. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what are we waiting for? Oh, we're not waiting for anything. Uh, uh, there we go. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay. It was, it was. A... Anyway, um, real quick. So we I were Skorak and I were discussing for like a hot minute what each of our classes would be. This made the most sense to the both of us. Chaser is very mm -hmm. obviously an arts guard. Um, yeah. Kuroko, you're an artificer, so you're technically you fall under the nerd category for subclass. Um, oh, fun. Geek. I think Blizzard is a mythic caster. Uh, or no, like your your is, is a core uh, caster. Blaster. The blaster, really? Yeah. And then I'm very clearly a bard. 
So, yeah, you know, there is literally a fucking subclass. Yeah. So, in case it's uh, debated, all also uh, we'll put out a poll after stream um, via the channel, and you guys can vote on next week what you want uh, Scorex reactive image to be. How about that? Oh. Well, I, I can't remain myself, yeah, can Jerboa. I? No, no, no. Jerboa. We're going to let the fans choose either Jerboa or... Sad Frog. Sad Frog or whatever it is. <laughs> you know, we'll options. put up a couple of them. Okay, there is four options in a poll, right? So yes. each one of Correct. us picks an option. One will no. be Jerboa, one will be Sad Frog. One should be me, okay? Like, the, there should be the option that I remain a Skorak for next fucking week. <laughs> Why? That's so lame. Why should that be enough? If they want me to remain a score, if they want me to remain a score, I don't fucking. <laughs> Why would they want me to remain a score? I'm, I'm gonna keep it a buck with you, Chief. I don't think they're gonna want that. Yeah. Why would they want you to be a score? You know, no, it's fine. Chat loves me. You know, right, Chat? <laughs> You're not want me to remain okay, a score. Okay. All right. That's <laughs> uh. Bring us on a last time on for for the campaign. Okay. Uh, you know what? Um, do not make hmm. me do it. Should I, should I do a last time on, or should I have one of you do it for uh, for an inspiration? I could probably do it. I think Class I, if you really thing, want like, that inspiration, go for it. Okay. Um. So last time on the Harmasis C Squad, we had our first job. We went into the we went into the building and had a meeting with Naw, the instructor rat lady. And initially, we were going to go to, like, a pretty, like, normal structure, a pretty chill one where there's not really anything and it's and it's normal. But then a call came in that one of the special C structures uh, it was shooting out laser beams into the sky. So they want us to go to that one instead on account of the laser beams in the sky situation. And now we're now we, we, we have gone to that one. Now, to get here, we had to go with the caravan. Uh, we had to go with the caravan to get out to this random spot in the desert where there's this big ol' city stuck in the desert that's shooting out laser beams. And that's where we met Larissa, who's another NPC, and she was leading this whole big caravan here. We got here, you know, we, 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 we had some discussions, you know, we, we, we've had discussions and everything, but you know, if, if you want the full details on character interactions, you're gonna have to actually go back and watch the content. Uh, I'm not yeah, gonna everything, you know. You you still you still have your homework to do, um, and then we 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 went inside. We have one day. We found some stuff, brought it back, and we're back inside again. Once again, we have one day. We made it there at noon. We have till noon the next day, and then we gotta leave. Yep, I think that's about it. You know, not that's as colorful, about it. Uh, but you right. know, I applaud hey, you for, for efficiency. I applaud you for efficiency. Um, I will say get that get that inspiration, take that off in your in your character sheet. And um, one thing you did miss though is uh, the place. Oh, um, you go to your sheet, and I think it should be right next to initiative. Oh. There's like a little box oh, yeah. that you just yeah. click on oh, it. Oh, I have yeah, a dragon there, there now. Yeah, you have a dragon there now. <laughs> Weird. You know, you guys are in now... a dungeon and you found a dragon. You know, it's it's, it's great. You know, yeah. baby dragon. Now, yeah. now I can go fucking. I can go take a piss with joy that I got a dragon. And I don't even have to worry about deafening anymore because I don't run the fucking stream. Wait, are you going to go take a piss right now? We're about to start. <laughs> My man's could have just muted too so he could keep hearing no, it's you. fine. Oh. Maybe his toilet's right, well, right next to his desk. It's fine. Should I, I, should I bring us back to I'm just look... chatting? <laughs> Yeah, I guess we should go back to just chatting for now. Well, guys, oh so God. about that the social economical situation in America, uh, what, what do you all think? Don't we only have one American now? What the fuck can we even say? <laughs> yeah, I, I think we're just gonna like a dog file on him. We're just gonna dog like, file on him. Like before, we we could like have like uh, Rain and Isaac actually discuss about it, but now it's like literally only one person. I like, have a lot to say. That's the problem is I have a lot to say about it, okay? It's really bad here. All right. Ah. It's, it's, uh, what as I told you guys to... before, I live in Los Angeles, which is a hellscape if you are not making $100,000 a year. Um, and I do pretty good for myself, all things considered. Like, as just a musician, as my main job, right? Music producer and audio engineer. 
and that's not enough here. <laughs> like, oh my God. Dude, the fucking two bedroom apartment we're living in right now is like a steal of a price compared to anywhere else. It is twenty one hundred dollars. For just the rent. Wow, uh, that a steal like a sounds month? extremely expensive. Anyway, oh, yeah, as month, Lali, month. Uh, says um, in chat, uh, did, did any of you see the fucking friend list purge that happened earlier today? You know that? No. What? Oh yeah, I heard. I heard there was like a friendly. So purge. pretty much there was a bug in the game that just purged everyone's friend list. So. From for yeah. what game? Uh, Ark Knight. For, for Ark Knight. So. Oh. So like, so like all of the friend list is gone. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> they fixed it. Like they fixed it now. But yeah, for like a, a little while, it was just purged. Um. I haven't played Dark Knights in so long, but I'm so out of touch with what the fuck yeah, is happening. Yeah, uh, honestly, I feel like I'm the only Dark Knights content creator that plays Dark Knights. <laughs> oh wait, is Rain back? <laughs> no, it's it's so it's so funny. People are uh, fuck. Rain. Like, whenever Dark I make my, whenever I upload videos, people are like, "Oh my god, you have so much sanity, bitch!" I don't. I I, I have so much sanity because I buy. Sanity. Like I'm playing it right now. <laughs> like I'm, I'm playing the game right now. Okay, okay. You're, you're so, literally the only person here that can still tolerate that game. <laughs> no, I play it. The fuck are you on about? I play it. What do you Just mean? It's not as much. Apparently, I'm not the person. Okay, there. okay. All right. We're good. Okay, oh, I'm going to like, 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 one like, simple okay, question for, for Skorak. Uh, on the drums that I have that give me a bonus to my attack roll on spells, uh-huh. uh, bard spells, Vicious Mockery is a, oh, it's a cantrip, isn't it? So does it count it's or no? Um, I'd say it still counts. It still counts. And how does that work? Section? Because yeah. it is in the spell section. Technically, I think it is a bard spell. But um, oh, wait, how does I that guess work? It doesn't work for vicious mockery because it's just a save, right? Well, does it make the save harder? I don't think so. It's just for attack spells that do, that have attack rolls. Oh, look it up. <laughs> That's all I wanted to ask. The danger bongos for them. <laughs> yep, exactly. Now, yeah, okay. Um, with everything yeah, ready, you'll be able to start. I, I, I said something. I've literally talked. Okay, cool. Um, is he, you is guys back? have uh, explored this particular wing of the sea structure. Uh, you have found rooms that you'd rather not, not really go into right now. I imagine. Um, you know, you found the vibration. Oh, the vomiting room. blood room. Uh, yeah, okay, exactly. we found uh, a congress. The vomiting blood room. The the fountain from uh, the test session. The uh, epilepsy room. <laughs> That's the only way I can describe it. Yes, I call it I the call, vibration. I call that room the soma room because there's oh, a fucking soma. Oh, uh, we in were there. also in case you don't remember. Um, was it Chaser or Blizzard? I think it was Chaser. Who? Uh, it was me and Chaser, right? Who got hit with the... What, so that went yeah, into the yeah, center into the room? room? Yeah. You were the two who vomited blood. It was you two. Okay. Yeah. Uh, from what I recall, we were also allowed to heal from that because I went back out to the truck and basically got pain kill or painkillers okay. for Getting a fucking split migraine. Painkillers doesn't make you recover this damage. That's like It's mental damage. For fuck's sake. I was, I was literally looking no, for something to recover. Out. No, I'm not gonna, just gonna give you a free fucking heal pot. What the fuck? Fuck. fuck. Take antidepressants instead. I, ta I take antidepressants. All right, fuck it, fine. Did <laughs> you take Xanax? <laughs> yeah, what if I take <laughs> Xanax to heal this? Just, just start taking anything. You, like fucking overdose on Benadryl. You'll have bigger psychic problems than that one. Scorax profile think he's stuck in the vibration room. <laughs> it went in there. It never got out. <laughs> He doesn't want to talk about it. Anyhow, so with that all sorted, um, there's a door in front of you. That door leads to what would be assumedly the control room. No, I told you to not go in the control room, but you don't really seem to have an option right now. Yeah, you closed off every other possible route. Exactly. God damn you, God. Yeah, do I do I do I still have bardic uh, inspiration? Do I still have bardic inspiration? Um, has ten minutes passed, uh, Scrack? I will say no. Okay, so yes, you still have bardic inspiration. Let's pass. go, boys. 
But we uh, need to go in the room last time. like immediately. Yeah, last <laughs> time uh, Seb asked yep. uh, off, uh, suggested that we have the Seaborn go explore in there, if I remember correctly. And it leveled up. Yeah, but that's where it found the, the, the little like, plus one stuff that it ate, and then it became a plus one sword. Oh, no, that's <laughs> no, no, I he's... did that. That, he... that was my idea. But yeah, uh, I he... mean, in the uh, control room, uh, yeah. Sebas suggested uh, to oh. go, make, it, make it go explore in the control room. Up to you. Uh, I think it fucking dies. Like, if, it, if there is anything, literally anything hostile in that room, it just fucking dies. So, I'm gonna have it very cautiously a peek into the room and then relay uh -huh. what it sees. Well, you know, I don't even need to describe what it sees because, you know, you. The, the, out of character, you guys have encountered before. In character, what this is, is an obsidian pillar in a room that looks like some sort of temple with four iridescent uh, smaller pyramids sort of uh, flanking it. And stairs coming from all four directions of the city, presumably leading to other wings. It appears this is the center, and this is the place from where Everything else sprouts. Uh, is it empty? Room? Is the there city. like a nobody in here? Well, can your seaboard speak? <laughs> well, I yeah, we made a pact, so at least with me, uh, it can communicate. Um, unless it made a pact with like miming <laughs> through like sign language. I don't know. I mean, it could have. Uh, or like just it can maybe communicate general concepts into your brain. Yeah, um, yeah, okay, yeah, that's uh, like uh, the same thing I do to it. Uh, like we communicate uh, concepts yeah. to each yeah. other. Um, roll me a perception, I would say. Just you okay, know. Okay, fine. I will. Uh, I will do as you say. Um. So from what the seaborn says. It appears as if there's some sort of like machinery set up around the pillar that appears to be active right now, right? Like pipes okay. and a sort of like small platform uh, that has like a grid on it. Um, okay. But you don't, nobody seems to be there as in human, right? Okay, then uh, I, I reform it into the sword and uh, I, I walk in, I very cautiously walk in. Into the room. Mm -hmm. uh, we're talking like 2001 Space Odyssey Monkey Black Obelisk. I mean, you can see it in the in the map. That's kind of how it looks. It is so drippy. Damn. Okay, so do you guys follow uh, Chaser in? Uh, uh, is it danger? Is it dangerous? Is yeah, it we don't. <laughs> No, if it's dangerous. Yeah, not. we don't know. It's, 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 That's uh... the point. <laughs> Is it? Uh, there? Uh, yeah. Sorry, uh, I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't tell you. Right. It's. Uh, it has precisely it's three guards. Oh, yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I, I forgot. It's There's a like a Mo boss. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's like twenty dudes, all yeah. of which very yeah. strong. So, you know, there's like a, there's like five very muscular men armed to the teeth. Hiroko. Okay, so uh, yeah. you're uh, a nerd, right? Uh, don't you have little bots or drones or something? Well, apparently, uh, I didn't come equipped with that kind of thing. I was given the bare minimum, and drones were not a part of it. If I had some scrap, maybe I could make something up. Great. Maybe. Well, uh, Chaser and I checked the last door, so it's one of your guys' turn now. Storak, can, can I, like, pop my head in and, like, look at the walls? Um, sure. I mean, the, world, the okay. walls look to be made of some sort of, um... You know, rock. Um, it looks to be like uh, like an inlaid sort of um, material where you have. So they're rocks. not dripping. 
like the middle. The, the middle's the only part that's dripping. The walls are normal. Wait, what do you mean dripping? Like, like, like you see how like the middle kind of pillar is kind of like dripping and kind of wet and kind of greased? Are no, the walls it's just, just like dry, just normal it's walls? Just, no, no, it's not wet and greased. It's it's just like that, like, it's it's that polished and that still that seems like a mirror, you know? Oh, so oh I, I, I thought that it, was yeah. like dripping. No, oh, it, okay. it, it has a uh, mirror finish. I'm stupid, all right. Yeah. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I'm just an idiot, all right. So, the, and the walls, I assume, normal? And the walls normal, yes. Okay, uh, in right. character, well, can I, uh, can I give, um, Blizzard a, a light push through the door? <laughs> he, he's I mean, not expecting yeah, it. I mean, yeah, he's not expecting it either, so. Um, I will still say that he could potentially tank it so he can do athletics to see if he, like, you know, holds his ground. Like, it's, it's probably going to be an athletic squad list. Unless Fuck you want to just let it happen. Yeah. Rain. Uh, that's, that's your call. And, yeah, no, I... I... I, I am gonna roll to like to like to like let it happen, but almost play it off like like he's like rolling and like almost doing like a little stunt into the room. Okay, okay. what do I have to roll? Tactical, uh, athletics. Athletics? Oh damn you! Hard, I'm, I'm getting shown. Shouldn't it be like something dexterity based? No, it's athletics. No, you're pushing him. It's athletics. <laughs> All right. Well, you still push him, but he does do like a cool, like tactical roll, and he looks like he's like he meant to do that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Chaser looks at him and he's like, "Oh, you, Blizzard, that was awesome." I'm just gonna it gesture so like, cool. uh, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna try to play that off like me not actually trying to push him in, but being like a, "Come yeah. on, go, go." <laughs> Yeah, you, you're both like playing it off as if you didn't get pushed and you didn't push it. <laughs> it's totally meant to both just, yep, meant to do that. Yep, 100%. All right, and then and I'm, I'm just like, like, no, Michael, it's on all that pillar, God damn it. <laughs> Kuroko is just like, ew. Okay. And I am going to, with my, with my booties, with my slippers of spider climbing, I am going to try to climb the walls and just see if there's anything around if i if i can get a better view also wait who started the the watch together song i didn't that, that wasn't me uh, yeah that shit is so intense by the way i, I don't know who yeah. started it either that like, shit goes hard that wasn't meant, that wasn't meant to start <laughs> now that, that wasn't, wasn't you was meant for later in the music. session yeah oh no we're fucked that's that's for later in this oh. session we're cooked we're cooked we're actually cooked. no you guys are cooked can you uh yeah, can you play something eerie scorak um, play something eerie. Uh, yes, I do have something eerie here. Thank you. Uh, um, well, it's eerie, but it's a little bit more of like a chase theme. So, just, you know. just, just let it up. Okay. There's a, there's okay, a, sure. There's a, there's a couple, there's a couple, so there's a couple, uh, there's a couple Subnautica soundtrack ones that you might want to look into if you don't have any good eerie ones. They've got some ambience that you know, makes you feel uncomfortable. The more just, I think uh... about this song, the more yeah. I think about this song, the more I think maybe it's not eerie. Okay. <laughs> also, it, why is it, it fucking? I don't hear anything. Really. Yeah, it isn't. It isn't. I, I, I hear it. It, 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 it kind of goes hard. Oh, it it is going on in the background. All right. By the way, chat, you can hear that, right? I, I cannot hear that. I have it really low. Okay, or chat I says yes. Listen better. The 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 song is really low, Spark. Do you want me what? to turn it up a bit more? You guys can do whatever you want. I can't hear it. In, in my fucking screen, this this thing is not playing. Oh, oh, so you're not talking about stream. Got it. I was wondering, like, do you want me to turn it up for stream? Uh, you can do that if you want. I don't, you know. Okay. No, no, so long as everyone sounds good for you. Okay, good. Yeah, I don't want it to overpower us. Yeah, so let's let's, uh, let's okay, keep going. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so, Blizzard, okay. you're, okay, you're spider walking up. All right. Yeah, just, like by the way, like no one, none of you have like seen me do this with these like boots. <laughs> this is just like I'm just I'm just starting to just spider up the wall. Spider-Man. The Spider -Man. Spider -Man. All right, I'm just gonna say fuck it because I'm I'm getting like tired of the shenanigans. I'm like okay, I just walk in. All right. 
Just walk in. Uh, do you guys uh, follow him in? I walked in a, a, a bit ago, so yeah, I'm, uh, I'm following him. Okay. As I'm walking it's in, I'll bad. take active perception. Fuck. Oh my god, YouTube is also not, not playing for me. What the fuck? Oh, that's... What the fuck is going on? Might be your audio drivers. Could be. Mark's going apart. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna restart my Chrome real quick. Uh, I, I, I'm gonna also be looking to perceive... Do I get... Is there any advantage to being up high, Skorak, or is it just standard? Uh, up high. I mean, you can't really be up high here, right? Like, there's just the walls and okay, the... So, so, so it's just, like, medium. You know. so, so it's just normal? Yeah. Yep. Oh, wow. Well, didn't even need to climb. Dude, I rolled a well, four. Well, needing to re-roll... Wait, is it just my fucking internet uh, that's fucking up? Four. Ooh, that'd be bad. Like I'm using... It very well could be. I'm using my good internet right now. I'm supposedly using like my megabytes that are actually like decent, decently fast. Hopefully stream quality is good for everyone at home. Yeah, I mean you're oh, hosting it, so while, hopefully it is. Yeah, while while we are kind of little 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 pause while we're kind of in this little moment of pause, you know, little little, little flavor that I that I, oh. I, I, I cleared with Skorak about the boots. The boots are the boots are essentially almost like little arts units and there's like like little ice crystals kind of coming out, sticking into walls and creating yep. like almost little platforms. Okay, I, mean, I, I am up. back. And, uh, Is it all working? I think everything should be... should be decently... good. Uh, let me see if the watch together works. Oh, now it, it's on Hollow Knight, so... Well, that's where it currently is. Oh, okay. Yeah. And you remember how to sure, lose stuff, Sure, I guess we right? can keep it here. Yes, I remember how to lose stuff. Um, this, all right. This, this, this honestly feels like a good theme for this situation. It's very, like, exploratory. Yeah, yeah fair enough. Uh, it so, it feels like you're looking around. Yep. Uh, as I said before, with your perceptions, you can uh, kind of see that... Well, not you, Sebas, uh, but you, Blizzard. You can see that there are machines hooked up to the pillar, like certain like tubes uh, with. Um... They seem to be made of like metal, like you know the, the the thing you have in your shower, your shower head, like the way that that is, the thing that's connecting it to the to the faucet. You. So like a you mean the like. Yeah. It is a tube, but I mean that particular kind of like type metal of tube. tubes. Yeah, yeah, like metal tubes that have like these small like, okay, so like the bending metal. In them. Yeah, the bending yeah. like almost spine-like metal tubes. Okay. Exactly that, that those tubes. Um, they seem to be in there, and you can see like in the parts between uh the more ring-like like metal parts, you can see this blue material almost like flowing inside of the of the big like column. Um, and you can see on the east side, there is a terminal with, like, a lot of, like, computer screens and um, different sort of, like, devices and that sort of, like, interface. Um, and to the right side, to the west side, um, there is a platform with a grid-like uh, pad on the bottom and um, some sort of almost, like, glass-like tube, like, surrounding it. Okay, so yes, the holes with the segmented rings exactly, Ren. Okay, so wait, so right, so on the right side, you said glass tube surrounding like a like a four square panel on the floor. Yeah, like a small like pad with like square like like a square grid. Um... Okay. Okay. What is this fucking like McDonald's play place looking ass? What the fuck? They call a glass tube into the fucking <laughs> grid on the ground? Yeah, there's gonna be like a gazebo in the next room. <laughs> like a ball pit. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Um. So, uh, observing it, like Blizzard's gonna kind of kind of relay that information everybody, to you know everybody that you got kind of the that you have the whatever the fuck glass tube with the with the um the pad on the right and the terminal 
out on the other side of the room, out on the left. Genshin a puzzle. You all may do with that information well, what you must. <laughs> Blizzard is gonna climb down. Yeah, honestly, the character are too fucking stupid to take initiative with any of that. 100% <laughs> I'm gonna break something if I do that, so... Oh boy. <laughs> Are there any, like, interfaces, terminals, or uh, doorways? Yes, on the east side there, of... There, 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 there's there's the a terminal like a big, on the... Yeah. Like, the, there's a big interface with, like, multiple screens and, like, different, like, terminals. Wait, 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 one, they are on opposite sides, but they both seem to be connected through these tubes to the thing, to the main, like, obelisk. Okay. Okay, because, you know, you, you confused me a little bit because you're talking about east and then right, and, like, east is kind of generally to the right. I okay. said east and west, but hey, you know? And west. I thought you said right! Hey, uh, Kuro. Can't hear either. Kuro? Roko? Yes. Yes, yes. Why don't you go, uh, check out, uh, that terminal over there? Uh, I mean... We'll go take a look around and see what may or may not be in the hallway. Alright. Okay. So, do I, uh, I guess I'll go to the terminal. I'll gesture, uh... Yes, you do. I will gesture Chaser to, um, cautiously go up to the, um... Is it a door or a hallway? Or like a corridor, open corridor. Um, there are four different staircases, right? You came from one, and the other three are leading to doors. Okay. We'll go to uh, one of the doors. Um, I guess, wh which uh, mm -hmm. which which steps did we come from? South, west, east, or uh, north? From south, from the, from down here. Okay, okay. Uh, we'll go to the west um, doors, and I'll just your uh, okay, so chase like, her to follow me. Here? Yeah. Uh, I diligently follow them. So, could I, like, interact with this terminal? Yeah. Yes, you can, but you will have to roll me hacking, because there, there does seem to be some sort of, um, like, you know, protective software that doesn't allow you to just, like, you know, open it and interface freely. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. Um... You kind of like you see you, you see like there, there's an open port right, and I imagine like one of your fingers kind of like extends like a little USB like from your artificial hand, and you just like oh, plug man. it in. <laughs> I, I turn you, into Ed, the Edward Elric hand, just start clicking it around. Yep, and you just hear from like your arm being like army interfacing at ten percent. Firewall bypass. Firewall. Could I? Okay, I want to learn. I want to look into what the hell I'm looking at. Uh, okay, this, uh, from what you understand with your hacking, this is some sort of device to interface with the pillar. Um, the pillar appears to have a few different functionalities, but what you can get with a 14 is that whoever is using it is kind of using it wrong. Like, they're all, it's almost like trying to, like, use a toaster to heat you up in the winter. Like, well... It, it, it technically produces heat, but you're making a very inefficient and non-like pre predicted use of this, right? So, they're basically I just, I, so I just don't know what the hell I'm this, doing with it. Yeah, they're taking this energy of this device and they're jerry-rigging it to do something it's not meant to do, essentially. All right, I want to look into, since I'm just doing basic stuff and I don't really know what I'm looking at, can I like look into specific files or anything? <laughs> Um, specific files. Okay, so you're trying to go into the file section, and it does seem like most of these are encrypted, so I will need you to do another. Like, the first one is to understand what exactly is happening here. If you want to actually get info about the files, you will need to do another. Okay, uh, decent enough. Uh, some of them are really well encrypted, so you won't get them. You get access to the more surface files. Um, you know that this... So, <clears throat> the people that are doing this, right, 
are a group called Corsica's Return. It's some sort of like Gaulish, like, you know, extremists that want to see like Gaul return, right? That's the, the group that, that is doing oh, this. My, oh my god, Corsica returns and he's wearing the fucking military jacket? Bro, really oh thought god, he was Napoleon. It's... It's always the French. It's always their fucking fault. <laughs> I swear to God. This is why they uh, are Avengers in the new episode. It's always story. the fucking French's fault. So yeah, so that's what you get. And uh, right now, the the person that seems to be the administrator of this device, um, he doesn't. You, you don't see his name, right? Of course, there's no his actual name in the files. Um, his code name, however, is uh, Ramiel, like uh, like the angel. Um, so this is General Ramiel, the person that is uh, currently operating this device. Um, you can see there are about like five operatives uh, currently stationed around this place. He's the leader. He's like the the leader of the operation. So there's five people in this building with us that are hostile. You could definitely. You know, you would assume. like that. Okay. I'd say they're only hostile to us that if we make them hostile. Well, you guys are on the eastern. Kuroko will have to, to, like, you know, relay this info to you. Oh, well, you relay this info or are you going to keep yourself? Well, I'm still looking at the computer. I'm still... I'm just trying to snoop around. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So is, so is, is, is Kroggy's character, is, is Kuroko, like, alone here and then everybody else is here or what? Yo, well, it's just me. Me and Chaser God. are I'm just on uh, on the west side. You didn't yep. follow okay, us. So you two are here. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. No. I, I'm. I'm. Uh, I'm like in the middle after climbing down. You guys are like here. Kuroko is here. Up here. Hey, and, Chaser. Uh, please are here. Why don't you send your little buddy is, to go is check that out all the, the Is that all the information I could get out of this thing? Um. Let's see, you go to 15, so I will give you one more tidbit. Uh, General Ramiel is... seems... it seems like whatever the fuck he's trying to do here, it has a lot of, like... he's playing the pronoun game a lot. He's going like, oh, him, and when he's here, and when we do this with him, and he's going to, the, like, do this, and, like, the we need that. For him, you know, like Bro, they just Bro's writing modern horror game lore. Yeah, he's like he's being very like purposefully cryptic. Bro, we they put a pronouns on in my fucking harm assist the fucking walk agenda as well. <laughs> I, I knew he's, I was waiting for him to say it. I just uh, saw that shit coming. Put, I'm like, this motherfucker's gonna bring it up. Oh no, my, in my fucking harm assist campaign. Do they have a blue hair too? I'm pretty sure all of us have color. I oh, know I'm the only one with colored hair. LMAO. Uh, no, remember Ramiel. If you guys remember from the death session, has white hair. <laughs> yep. Yeah, he's a whole deviant see. Okay. He's he's so... absolutely a whole deviant artist. <laughs> uh, all right. So while yeah, okay, so uh, Kuroko's doing yeah, that. Uh, by the way, if you you guys will not know that, but if you do remember in the death session, he did introduce himself as Cerberus. So that that might be. That might be something. We can't yeah, know that. Do that doesn't mean that. anything to us. You can't know that. Hush, hush. It doesn't mean anything to you guys. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't fucking so, okay, put it in red yeah, hair. I'm that over there with Cybus. To the community, and, uh, the, to the game theorists. <laughs> I, I unsword the Seaborn and I, I send it to cautiously scout the next room. All right, all right. Uh, you send it to cautiously scout the next room, and I will need you to roll stealth. <laughs> All right, I got a hole too. Uh, oh, oh that, there you go. Oh, <laughs> it, it, oh, it's, oh, it's invisible. It's fucking is. invisible. And the fucking seaborn is a goddamn oh, shinobi. Holy shit! Yeah, it just it just like fucking like slushes into the corners of the room, like being absolutely fucking undetectable. And you see that the next room seems to be a sort of like storage almost like a big sort of um, storage room with multiple weapons of different sort of like um origins and time periods you can see like victorian swords Sar um, sargonian halberds uh Karagian, like staves you can see all of this like and they all look to be from different time periods as well 
like um you can see like uh some weapons that you specifically would recognize from the iberian like golden age some like sabers and guns that seem to be like way too old you know and um this is like this weird almost like museum of different weapons um and there's two people in there uh that seem to be kind of like uh conversing with each other uh they both wear gaulish uniforms not as big and fancy as uh you know um but they both wear gaulish uniforms and they currently have like helmets on that seem to like have this sort of weird pattern where there is a skull on the front and the left side has like a ornamental like angel wing sticking out and the right side has an ornamental devil wing like sticking out um well, what are and, they yapping about? Uh, right now, they seem to be relatively uh, quiet. You know, just kind of like um, taking turns, kind of like doing the, like, you know, patrolling the perimeter. They're not together. They are both like on opposite sides of the storeroom, kind of like clockwise doing the perimeter. And every now and then you see nice. like they, they, they switch and they go counterclockwise. So they How to do they move? Are they like uh, particularly stiff while they move? Uh, fuck. Um, roll me a perception. Okay. You know, roll me a perception with advantage because of your stealth being that good. Uh, oh, you know what uh, well, I, I, I got a I, 20. Got <laughs> Unless you get a natural oh 20, God. you won't gonna get anything else. Um, they seem stiff, but not in the sense of, like, non-human stiff, in the sense of, like, very well-trained military, right? They seem to be moving human, but, like, very well-trained, very well-regimented human, you know? Like, all they're fucking doing uh, is uh, running around in circles in one room. Th that's what they're doing. Yes, uh... but it does seem to be, like, for patrol reasons, for, like, you know... Uh, okay, okay. That's... Soup, uh, are you gonna okay. relay this to me? Like, whispering it? Yeah, no, I assume the Seaborn, like, came back and told the this to, uh, okay. to chase her. Okay, well, no, that, I don't know if you decided to keep it out or and, just uh, tell me. And then, yeah, ch chase her, then tell us to save us, okay. the, this whole okay. thing. I will the, very people. quietly close the door um, and uh, lean in. Hey, you still feeling inspired? Let's go check out the North Corridor. I mean... Surely we can't get in there, so might as well try our luck away from the other rooms. Right. Well, I have an idea for this room here. Let's go. We'll walk over to the north one. Mm -hmm. uh, and... uh, what you want to the north one will require you to like move through the center. So, Kuroko, do you want to relay to them now? Like, uh, is that all the information I could get from the terminal? Right now, yes, that's all the information you can get from the tower. All right, then I'm... You could try operating it, but you have no fucking clue what that's gonna do. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. Do it. I want to fuck it up. I mean, yeah, sure. Oh, let's go. God. That will be engineering with disadvantage. Oh, with shit. disadvantage? Okay. Well, roll another one. Yep. Okay, well... Oh, no, that's a 12 <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so, it's not below a 10, so you don't fuck it up, but it's not high enough. Don't randomly so... set off security protocols. You basically do it, and you're, like, you're about to trigger the security protocol, and you see your arm just, like, logs you out immediately. Like, it's like, danger, my, danger. My, just... my arm just blows smoke in my face. Ha! <laughs> yeah, like... You know, I'm just like vents steam in your fucking face and you just fucking like Fuck. blow away. <laughs> Alright. You are welcome. <laughs> Everything good there, Kuroko? <laughs> Shut up. Just asking. We're there. And uh, while she's been so cordial with us, uh, we're gonna relay that there's two people over in that room, so like, don't go there. There's like a bunch of weapons, like a museum, there's two while... people patrolling, don't fucking go there. While you're at okay. it, keep your voices down. I'm gonna relay my information to them. I got it in like, I have like a mini flash drive. Alright, got it. How about you do it? 
And I like 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 have walked over them, or, or am I kind of still stuck? Yeah, I'm where gonna, I was? No, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna walk over to them, and then while they're doing their little spy action shit, then yeah. give them what I told them, or tell them what I found out. Okay. What I could find out. So, so tell them. All right, gang. So apparently, this there's a uh, five things in this building, and I do not know if they're like. Enemies or not, but five things as it looks in like, like you five all. Five people total? Five things as in five people? Yeah. <laughs> five entities. I do not know. I got what I could. Don't don't heckle me too much about it. Well, but it we seems already like you saw. You lot. We already saw two of them, so there's only three more. Uh, Did you happen to get anything? Did you happen to get anything else? Any of that background information that they sent us here for? Anything about their goals? You know, their leaders? Well, they're trying I to got this place, got a, like a good few info. For one, there's the people here uh, doing something. And yeah. they, yeah. and there is this thing, uh, this uh, fucking uh, return, Corsica's return thing, uh, that uh, we surely got to mention that. Oh wait, did, 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 she, did, did, she already, did she already mention that stuff? I don't think she did. No, I didn't. I was gonna talk about oh, it. Oh fuck, but okay. You yeah, are, you are, I was assuming... She just Bra Bra is okay. inside my arm. <laughs> but yes, there's the admin, apparently is some Romulus or whatever. And then Romulus? <laughs> well, some some Oh no. <laughs> Romulus and Remus. Yeah, yeah you heard it here, folks. <laughs> yeah, Romulus. Bro. <laughs> Bro, but, it's Ramael. <laughs> no, no, Ramael. we're gonna call him Romulus from now on. <laughs> like, she means Romael. She means remembered, <laughs> and now it's Romulus to us. <laughs> Roma. But, yeah. Roki, did so, you happen to... I only to... got a bunch of surface level stuff. Did you but... happen to get the names of all the other officers? No. My arm got rejected before I could do anything more. So you only saw that there are five potential personnel here in the base. Yes, and there's did... four, five entities around. And only but, got the name of that's... the administrator. Yes. All right. Do you get anything surrounding the goals, the why? No. Yeah, what is uh, Korshika's return doing? Like, uh, who are they? Did you get any any of that, maybe? Well, it's you're, you're asking a bit much for me from this, when I don't even know what the hell this big-ass structure is. So All right. if you want to take a crack at it, be my guess. Chaser. But I got what I could. Can you check this door? I'm gonna slowly like open it just enough for his uh seaborn to, to go in. This is north door, right? Yes. Okay, do I roll the stealth to... again? You guys going to the north door, okay? Yeah, you roll stealth again. Roll this with time advantage. It is, uh, or roll with not advantage, uh, uh roll with um uh, another d6 and add that on to your roll. That's inspiration. Bardic inspiration. Oh, okay, so I I roll uh Okay, you need to roll uh, above a 20, so let's hope that d6 is good. Oh my, say above a fucking 20? What, is there someone's just staring at the door? Jesus. Maybe. No. I got oh, 19! I got 19, bro! You're so ass. The void. The void oh. that calls. You can't stack inspiration either, so... Yep. Wait, oh so, my fucking god, okay, yeah. You, it enters the room, and it's, uh, it seems to be an office. Like, you don't know the architecture, right, because you've never encountered this sort of architecture before, uh, but it's an office with a small library, a desk, um, you know, a phone, like, on the, on, on the desk, uh, you know, picture, it's, it looks very much like a, like a very textbook sort of office, and... Behind it, there's a door, um, and it looks like there's a man sitting in the office. That man has like right hair. Desk. <laughs> Seems to be a fallen Sancta. It's the and he has heterochromic eyes. <laughs> well, and he's we... looking straight at your seaborn as it cracks open the door. <laughs> Oh, so there was a guy staring at yes, the door. There was a guy staring at the door. 
bruh. That's like his job. He stands like, in the office so and looks at the door. Unfortunately, it's we, his office. We don't you know this said, until until the Seaborn comes back, right? Um. So I would imagine the Seaborn wouldn't slide in as soon as he notices that the guy sees him. <laughs> Probably. Retreat back. Yeah. When... So the Seaborn like cracks open the door, slides in, and you guys just see it stop. <laughs> They, like, stare at each other, like, in a fucking cartoon. Yeah, they just stare at each other. And, and then he just, just slowly walks slow. back, keeping <laughs> eye slowly contact. Creep. Like, slowly keeping creep eye back. contact, he just slowly walks back. He yeah, just like, slowly turns back and closes the door. <laughs> okay. Okay, then I relay this information to Sam. <laughs> just, like, get up, the dude uh, just sits there, and he's like, well... Uh, you guys have very little time. What are you gonna do? <laughs> okay, so I have a very high intimidation, and I also have the eyes of Charming. We could, we could go there, and I try to intimidate the poor office guy. Run. It's just an office dude. Just, just run. I, I like. Let's run to the west yeah, corridor. Like, 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 okay. like, so, how this yeah. this is happening right now? The Seaborn knows what's happening. Why the Seaborn relays it mentally to you, Chaser. Like, it doesn't. You don't know exactly what's going on. It just relays like. Person, danger, person, danger, right? Like, that's what it says. You need to relate to everyone else, and you guys need to figure out what the fuck is you're gonna do. Hmm? There's around. a person, it's very dangerous, apparently. And so dangerous, right. it uh, retreated immediately. All right, great. Uh, we have the background information. Let's just go Let's go back the way we came. We, we have what we need. We'll get a nice payday, and if we're out quick enough, we'll all live. How does that sound? I'm going to just start running immediately. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it right, seems yeah. like he agrees with Blizzard. <laughs> Full sprint. Well, all right, we're agreed. And we're and uh, and, so, and before I turn to run... Big thing. I... Where were you guys in the room when you started running? I know that Chaser and Sebas were up there. On the, they were next to the door. So they are. they have the biggest disadvantage here. Was Kuroko still in the terminal? No, she went up with us. You went up with uh, did Kuroko, uh, do you go up with them? Yes, I'm out. What? No, no, you're not out. You're up. <laughs> you're, you're the farthest from out. I'm just. Uh, Lisa, did you just, also just go over, up? With I'm, them? I'm just over here, here at the base of the stairs, listening. Bro. Okay, so you're at the base of the stairs. You're like, um, you're like here. Hold on. I can't even see it. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, like, 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 cool. like, like, like so, I'm. I'm down at the base. You guys are sprinting. I need all of you guys to roll me athletics. The DC is a little bit easier for you, Blizzard. Okay. Okay. Athletics. Could I, theoretically, Mr. Skorak, if I were to drop, like, one of these on, like, that area at the top of the stairs, would that make it a little easier if if we got this if we got this fog coming it, in? It won't make you reach the, the reach the other door faster. Uh, yeah, you're giving up six Whoa, seconds. No, but it's it's. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay. Your fair, cast fair. time is yeah. one action. That is that, six that's, seconds. That's fair. That's you can fair, still that's run, but while point. casting, you can't dash while casting, which means you will be. Bro, slower. I'm cooked. I'm fucking cooked. <laughs> I'm, I'm dashing. Cooking, you are. Bro, it's not... You are. Uh, you, you're all dashing unless you're, you're saying to, to do anything else. Um, Blizzard, roll me your athletics. You're. Oh my. Uh, oh my bro, fucking we god. Are, you're we are. So it's a zero. Bro. Sorry, like I am a zero. Shit, bro. We all roll I like zero, shit. Bro. bro, you are a, you are a weak. You, you're weak. You're anemic. You didn't drink your milk while growing up. Why are you. <laughs> I think team. Chaser if might I be the only one magic. who has fucking advantage on athletics. No, he doesn't even have adva oh. not advantage. He, he Wait, doesn't know the yeah. skill. Yeah, what you Could I give uh, a shot at this with my inspiration? <laughs> you could. You, you definitely could. You can definitely use inspiration here. Please. Please, God. Go please. Oh, oh god. my god. <laughs> you know what? I am a gracious DM. Fuck it. I don't allow duplicates for this. Roll again. <laughs> okay, okay, there we, there go. we go. So, what happens is you guys start running, and all of you, like, go through and go towards the door, and 
Blizzard, you get through the door, and as soon as you get through the door, the door at the north blasts open, and you see the man raise his hand, close his fist, and Sebas, Chaser, and Kuroko, as you guys are dashing up the southern stairs to go through the door, oh, it just slams close in your face. <laughs> slams what? Slams, slams closed, like, in, yeah, slams closed. Hmm? Oh, okay. So well, Blizzard is, is the only one that makes it is. out. Yeah. Blizzard is out, everyone else is in, and now we're getting the theme. <laughs> okay, um... I'm gonna just quickly turn around, because the, the door's been closed now. Uh, active yep. roll and perception for this guy. Mm-hmm. Um... Active rolling perception, you see what I described at that session. Tall man, white hair, one eye red, one eye purple, um, you know, fallen uh, Sancta, so like pointy does ears. Does he have boards, a name tag? Because you know, he had no, a uniform. He just has, that's no, why. he has a uniform. He doesn't have a name tag. He, he has a military uniform, right? They don't come with name tags. <laughs> that's uh, okay. That I asked because they do here in actually not just the States, many countries. That's why I ask. Not really. It's like a Gaulish, like, you know, general's uniform, uh, right? From what I can... Yeah, okay, like, general, all right. Like big cape. Yeah. Um, That's like a big cape. I don't know how, how like... So how, I, I guess um, the best way you could describe him to me is he is a man of high stature and, like, high, like almost nobility. What I would perceive is, like, nobility. Yeah. Right? Um, okay. I'm not sure how familiar Sebas is with... Um, the goal is like no. chain of command. But I can, very I can, fancy fucking uniform. Yeah, I'm like, you I can, can still get a vibe. I can absolutely still get a vibe yeah. of uh, who I'm uh, dealing with. Motherfucker yes. is fucking uh, deafened again, dear God. <laughs> oh my fucking, where does he keep going? <laughs> I, even if he pees, he should just like mute, not deafen so he can hear what's going on. Oh gosh. Okay. Uh, should I just continue? Cause I got some stuff. Actually, I rolled my perception, which is technically my. It's not six seconds. It's a an ability check, but uh, or yeah. a skill check. But I would um, say, before he like does like anything big, you guys have like it's it's perception. Whatever you can perceive him like, whenever you want. You can do something else if you want as well. Um. Uh. Okay. Uh. Best thing I can do, at least for Sebus and his uh, survival state brain, is mm -hmm. um, immediately look towards him. Like a, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try because it's military, right? This is actually yeah. part of my background and what I can do in terms of how I present myself to other people. Um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna pick. I pick up on the fact that he's military. I will snap to attention immediately in front of him and then get down graciously on uh, on uh, one knee, head down. Ooh. And uh um, right. yeah, and Welcome recite to, uh, just uh actually yeah, what, what do you guys do before I say anything? Yeah. I'm just gonna let it's you do like your thing because cool I do not want to interact with this room. I will uh also Are shoot you, you guys nothing? I'm gonna shoot you guys a stare of like do the same. Uh yeah, I'm gonna do the same. Yes. I guess I'll do this. That seems like a good I'll idea, comply. actually. I'll comply. Uh, I mean, I will... look, Neil, this is like a fantasy, like, like ancient France military, right? Like, you know? <laughs> this right, guy... Karaka's social skills, she's not gonna fucking interact with this. Uh, I will uh, then uh, say out, uh, as my head is still down, uh, my lord, forgive us for disturbing you. It wasn't our intention. Cool. Do I need so a roll wait, for Jason that? Is I, I... Crow, are you doing it? Uh, you, need, you don't need to roll for that because there's five people in his command. He knows who they are. He can tell you're lying. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'm not saying as if I work for him. Okay. The the aura I'm you're trying to give trying off in to, my speech is, is uh, I, he's clearly yeah. somebody high up. And... Okay, you're just trying to operate and like appease him and just yes. fucking you know. Precisely. Okay, cool. 
cool. It, it is definitely um, not me love... speaking with confidence of like, no, I work for you. You know me. You know, definitely not. Especially okay, when okay. I know for a fucking fact there's only five people there. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, sure, I guess that would be just a charisma, you know? For, well, shouldn't charisma it be one of my, uh, shouldn't it be persuasion or deception? It's definitely not deception. Um, I guess persuasion, sure. We can, we can do persuasion. Or performance. All of the same. Technically, it is a performance. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they're all the same. Okay. All right, all right. Um, that actually means I rolled terribly. <laughs> yeah. I have a six on that. <laughs> I rolled an 11. All right, that's still pretty good, though. I think I crashed. Oh, uh, Supa, can, can you hear us? Supa. Hello, Mr. Mr. Supa. Oh, this really is easy. We cannot hear you. Soup man? Soup man. <laughs> Soup boy? Soup boy? Okay. Oh! We're getting audio. Wait, I heard, I heard the fucking slap from his fucking... from his mic. He's deafened. Hello? Make sure Super you have the right boy. mic hooked up. Double check your mic settings just in case it changed or something happened. I am I am so chilling right now in this scenario. I'm so chilling. God, Except for when you went deafened. <laughs> yeah. When I named you guys Cisco, I didn't know it would be that like accurate of a name. Apparently. <laughs> Oh boy, what's up? Okay, Hello? let's um. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh my yeah. God. Yeah. Any of you anymore? <laughs> Hold on. I knew it. Hold on. Right. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get real quick, but I'm gonna out. do it the proper way. Okay, thank you. Let's go. So, Jason, what are you doing? Sebas is putting on this whole performance. Oh, okay, uh, now I can hear you. Okay, now I can hear you. Okay, cool, cool. What are you doing? Seba's putting on this whole performance, trying to appease the guy. Uh, what are you doing? Okay, I'm gonna go uh, along these lines. I'm gonna be, uh, ah, yes, sir. We heard your tale so far and wide. What kind okay. of bluff is this? Rocco? Uh, I'm just, uh, like, qu quaking in my booties. And I'm just like, my lord, uh, my my liege, and I just uh, stay, keep my head down and let the big boys do the heavy work, because I don't even know what the <laughs> hell we are talking to. All right. Well, I'm hot. True, Blizzard. What are you doing? You're kind of like stuck in the I'm square. I'm leaving. Oh, you're just fucking rot. You're abandoning them. <laughs> Hey, well, I, I mean... Hey, man, get that, get that bag. Maybe. I'm get, you kind of gotta... Alright, if, if he chooses to do that, that's fine. That he, he's able to you do cut that. Your losses. Yeah, you cut can your do losses. that if you want. Cut your losses. Uh, I would. Uh, like, 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 and, and, and kind of Blizzard, as... As he's leaving, kind of, kind of, kind of like, as he's running, running, like, like, like looks back and, and, and kind of says under his breath, like, if I achieve all that I want, uh, I'll certainly remember the three of you. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> and he's and he is gonna and he is out of there and heading back to the caravan. Okay, so little thing, right? We're gonna go with the others first, then we're gonna see what happened with you. Uh, so you three do that. That's not a good see sign. Scorax gonna man... Scorax gonna slap me around a little bit. The, 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 the man kind of like looks at all of you prostrating yourselves and like that's definitely enough for him to not immediately fucking vaporize you <laughs> um he's like well well I do not appreciate being interrupted again I suppose people who know their place are better than the alternative If I may... Who are you? <clears throat> with your permission to speak, my lord. I am Sebus. We were sent here to... peruse... your property. 
and I apologize deeply, for we did not know. Ruse. Correct. So, Sebas, I have never heard of professional tourists before. It was under the guise of another company who essentially forced us to come uh. here. In fact, Maybe? you may be familiar with said company. They gave us no information of you. Well, I'm listening. <laughs> he, he will not like that. Blue Thorn Appraisal, if you have heard of it. Ah, uh, the dirty scavengers. Oh, God damn it. Indeed, Seems your grace. I will never be rid of them. And with those hidden fuckers always on my ass, at least I, uh, I need is another competitor. He just... Now we're associated with them. Bruh. <laughs> if these scoundrels, as you say, are impeding your work, might we perhaps trade information? With utmost respect. Hmm. I doubt there is any information you could give me that would particularly help in this particular moment. I have everything handled, but I mean, what's the hurt? Is not live updating information useful, Your Grace? Someone such as wise as yourself, surely you would find use in it's it. It's only useful if you have something to be afraid of. Now, please regale me with uh, doubtless everything that you have already prepared to uh, assuage my wrath. <laughs> From what we had been given, propaganda spreading of this structure reactivating and they didn't give us much more info but to be extremely cautious inside of a certain individual. We are, of course, unaware. Hmm. Well, it is true that uh, the process has taken a bit longer than I thought of. He can be quite stubborn. But I suppose you would be happy to know we are almost done here. Extremely enlightened. Your grace. The yes, messenger I... of which you uh, let loose had done a terrible poor job of informing us of your ultimate plan. Oh? The only Would reason be... I, let that, I let that rat live is to spread word of my accomplishments. Are you saying she was uh, tardy with her assignment? Quite so. If you would humble our ears, if it's not too much to ask you, Grace. I will properly regale this tale. Hmm. Roll me another persuasion. Also, what are the other two of you doing? Are you just letting him do all the talking? <laughs> I'm just letting him do the talking, because okay. God knows I'm not going to interact. I, I, God knows uh, I don't know what to say to this fucking I'm beginning. picking up a more of the story, so like uh, when I talk, I don't just like uh, step on his foot, uh, you know? I'm going to inter... No, you should totally, you should totally... You should totally say something. Like uh, yeah, I'm going, going to intervene if necessary. If like, he, if, like, he can't come up with something, I'm going to intervene. So, yeah, I guess, yeah, they're letting me just, just kind of lead like this conversation milk? For, the, yep. for the party. Uh, one more persuasion, then. Okay. The yapping. We're going to die anyway. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, not to 20. What the oh. fuck? We're out, never so mind. Persuaded. My words are Yo, supposed to be like honey. But we, we work for yeah. him now, I guess. <laughs> get, like, get, get, let him let us leave. Let him let us leave. You know what? We fucking work for him now. I like you, Sebas. Uh, Nulls. What was it again? Nulls, your grace. <laughs> Very well, then. I suppose you are definitely more receptive than that rat. And if I am to ever be rid of those pests at Bluethorn, I'll need someone that can actually tell them what kind of danger I, th I pose. But 
you know what? <laughs> I'll do you one better. What is the usefulness of a story without an ending? By You'll be means. able to watch me finish my work here. And then there will be no more doubt for any. So long as we too, your loyal, lowly assistants, could be part of this vision, of course. Very well then. I suppose the all that's left is, stay, is, is taking some seats and watching my magnificence at war. Mm -hmm. And, you know, with a natural 20, you guys are off the hook. He's just, like, fully letting you fucking, like, you know, do as you please. All right. Uh, I will... Actually, I'm going to I'm gonna ask him. Uh, your magnificence, is there uh, anything we should uh, relay once uh, we're out of there as your uh, servants? Is there anything you want us to do? Well, I suppose to all of the subpar aspirants that would try to contend my sea structures, tell them this. I will activate them all. I will okay. claim them all. And at the end of the day, I will be able to use them. All of the usurpers, all of the pretenders coveting their power will be crushed under my foot. I'm like writing this down, like actually writing this down. Uh, this I already command part of the power. Covetous pretenders crushed under heel. <laughs> Blizzard, you're not here. I already... <laughs> Yeah. You left us, Trader. I know. I feel like that. I'm just... <laughs> yeah. You're your fun. I'm just trying to make a joke. Get this man eaten by a sandworm. Get this man eaten by a sandworm or something. Oh, BM, crush your skull. I Thank you. I can't do anything. <laughs> I'm outside of there. I can't do anything. <laughs> um. What? What do you... I you want me to fucking try the dice roll trick again? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So, so what is this guy gonna yeah. be? Uh, continue saying. Like, I command part of the power of the original administrator, and with this, I will claim its entirety. And what that? shall what shall the? Uh, uh, did he already say his name? Did he announce himself? Um, no. He did. Okay. Um, so you will be replacing. Um, it's, uh, God damn it! Now, ever since the fucking um, Ramiel, there we go, there we go. Since he made the Romulus fucking joke, it's been stuck in my head. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you'll be oh, replacing no. Ramiel, correct? No, General Ramiel. That's. I am he. Ah, bruh. Forgive my ignorance, Your Grace. Bruh. Wait, how do you know that? <laughs> Part of the information that we found here in the structure. Ordained oh, by you in your... Terminal. Ordained by you in <laughs> your grand... In your grand scheme. As I'm, like, looking over at, uh, at Kuroko, I'm like, don't fucking talk over me. So you infiltrated the terminal. Only cursory uh, things. Hmm. And as I said, we will bring you any and all active information. In fact, Bluethorn has a vault of its own, filled with artifacts. Powerful yes, tools and trinkets that, I mean, I uh, that, while you may have no use for, may be of value to you. Yes, it's an appraisals company, I would imagine that. Now, who was it that infiltrated the terminal? I'm, uh, I'm just gonna take a step, like, one step back, a respectful step back. And, uh... 
mentally I'm looking over at like Kuroko, but I'm I'm not necessarily gonna sell Kuroko <laughs> out just yet. I'm gonna wait. Bruh, well, I, you're 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 waiting for the opportune moment to say, yeah, she's the one that fucking did all. Of, uh, <laughs> well, did, did the I'm scene. gonna give you an opportunity. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you an opportunity to fucking step up because, I, well, you know what? No, I can't tell you my line of reasoning because we don't have fucking telepathy. So mm -hmm. you have a moment to do whatever it is you want. I, mean, I should not have said that. <laughs> no, I can't, okay. I'm still like uh, fighting you know down. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna. So he's like in terror, wondering why the fucking you know that, right? Yeah, you, you, you know about the thing. Okay. No, well, yeah, the I'm gonna, Who, who was it that went in the tournament? I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw my hands up like throw a bunch of hand signs like <laughs> uh, about that about that uh my lord my liege good gracious good grace uh so i was just um you know uh, uh, uh blue thorn you know uh, they uh oh. <laughs> your grace they, please you want some please uh but if us Yes. She will speak. But, uh, you know, they wanted the information. But, you know, I could, since we're in this predicament... And so it was you who did it? Y yes. I would never lie to you, uh, Lord. Uh, but, you know, I was just doing as I was told and under orders. Uh, so... uh, 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 I... It's fine. All I wanted was a little bit of transparency. And last of course, time, of and course. Time, try to not dance around the subject so much. Of course. It's, I, I, I only, think, uh, was curious, you know? Uh, an intellectual such as myself. <laughs> well, uh, you know, thirst for knowledge and all that. <laughs> but none such as wise as you. Of course, Your Grace. Yes. And then I uh, scurry back into a huddled position and, and then slide back like a cockroach with my ears dragging across the floor. Well, take your seats then, I suppose. The show's about to start. And he's going to go to the terminal. I mean, you, we, we, you rolled a uh, net 20 persuasion. So yeah, you rolled a net 20. Live anyway. I was going to I was gonna live regardless, so I can say what the okay, fuck. No, no, you, you could have fucked it up roll. badly. Yeah, yeah, if you said, uh, yeah, actually, we're here to fucking kill you, actually. Okay, you know? I would never say that. <laughs> well, I yeah, at that, that point, you're on your own. <laughs> I'm yeah, not, I'm not fucking a, helping No matter you. what the roles say, there is a certain point where you, if you, if you inner be fucking up bad enough. <laughs> well, I, well, I didn't. Okay. I just pissed so, myself a little bit. Good thing is that his attention is no longer on you. You guys have a little bit of privacy. You can talk amongst each other. As he's like setting up the, the terminal. I'm gonna lean over and just say, I, I don't know guys, I, I think uh, we should be on this side, the winning side. <laughs> I want to be the same thing, actually. You know what, I don't really I think we should actually ally with money. this guy. I think this guy's cool and he, he should do what oh, cool. he says. We barely know anything about this guy. This well, guy is gonna kill us. He can close doors with his hand and or mine. And if this is the same guy from B Squad, he can eradicate people with a thought. Can Na do that? No. Can anyone at Bluethorn do that? No. So. So you'd rather throw away your dignity? I mean. Okay, dignity. I. I... Like, this we do, life. like, a, a fucking, you know, with the, the arms, we talk to each other, and, and I'm like, Kuroko, dignity is not very important when it comes to survival. And if there is one thing I learned as an Iberian pirate, is that if you see a clearly winning side, you go to that side. You know, I keep forgetting that I'm working with mongrels around here. Ugh. If you want to stand up for justice, I'm not whatever you. <laughs> you define as justice, by all means, go for it. Piss Who said anything me? about justice? This is about. I mean, I get that we're trying to. If survive, you care so right? much you know about I'm gonna... dignity, 
Then why don't you go and piss off the demigod? By all means, you're on your own though. I never said that. I never said then that. Then okay, shut I'm gonna, the hell up and just I'm gonna go pick up it. the Seaborn. I'm gonna ask the Seaborn for an opinion too. What, what does the Seaborn think? No, no, no. I'm gonna suggest to you that you tell the Seaborn to fucking get him to find us a way out of here. Out of this place. No. I'm gonna ask an opinion because I'm here for oh, the Seaborn. No. Like, the Seaborn wants me to be here. So, like, what, what does the Seaborn think? The Seaborn uh, doesn't really have an opinion about all this. It just really wants to eat that guy's eye for some reason. Well, then, being close to that guy, I'm gonna achieve that goal even easier. Hey, glum glum, I guess. <laughs> While he's sleeping, I'm gonna have him eat his fucking eye or something. I don't know. Bro, he's gonna, he's gonna go Kratos on Yeah, so uh, I talk to the Seaborn and I just say, Yeah, the little Seaborn over here agrees. What is this demigod's fucking opinion on the Seaborn? I mean, <laughs> it he's, he's didn't like, obliterate it, so <laughs> at least yeah, it tolerates the Seaborn. Yeah, I don't think he's, he's like commented on it. <laughs> Yeah, it so he didn't obliterate it on sight. Even though Seaborns so... are just kind of like, you know, number one worst thing on Terra right now. Is it not everyone is, like, familiar with what a Seaborn is? It's, uh, like, you might yeah. just think it's a weird creature. It, it's hmm? Iberia, uh, potentially Siesta, and a lot of the coastal cities are very fucking familiar. If you're close to the water, right? And yeah. typically the water of, of the south. If this guy is like, you know, meant to be more goal side, he it might be reasonable to assume he doesn't know what a seaborn is. Yeah. Well, I mean, also the seaborn threat wasn't it's a big a, it's, thing it's, it's when uh, <laughs> when Gaul was around. Like he's a researcher either. Yeah. Look, when yeah, Gaul was around, though, uh, the seaborn threat wasn't much of a thing, like at all. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't think he'll know. Yeah, I think no, it's no, just no, a no. silly little guy. So him. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a silly <laughs> little guy. It's just a little guy. Anyhow, uh, so yeah, we're we're sitting, and uh, I'm gonna just be now that I've had that conversation about whose side we're on, which is the side that lives. Uh, I'm gonna very attentively watch what he's doing. All right. Yeah, same same thing. Gonna, uh, do as he says. I'm gonna grab a seat and enjoy the show. Blizzard. Yes, what do you, 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 you run out, you run out, and you find the caravan. Uh, uh, what do you do? You will run up to them and say what? <laughs> um. Can, 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 I imagine they can see, you know, may, 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 maybe a little panic, you know, maybe. Uh huh. We have a situation. You see Larissa just raise a brow. That situation being? You know, the... The guy who can... Kill you by thinking you out of existence? What? No, I don't... What? Uh, oh, oh, they didn't tell you about that, huh? Um... I thought, Skorak, that she knew about that? No, no, she's just a guide. Really? Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna. I, I. I will have to fucking re-listen to to their conversation from last episode because I could have sworn that. Oh. She knew some things. She knew nothing about but, it. Uh, I yeah. was. That was exclusively Naw and internal people at the Bluethorn. Nope. She knew that it was a death trap at the very least. Yeah, yeah. She knew it was a death trap, but that's because she's sending you guys to a fucking sea structure. <laughs> Ah, okay, so, there's a guy who can, as I said, uh, think you out of existence. Currently, everybody else is stuck in there with the guy who can think you out of existence. Huh. Are they dead? I... maybe? I don't know. Well... If they're not dead, then we wait. Yeah. 
Um, there would happen to be anything at all we can do, would there? <laughs> Against a guy that can think you out of existence. Yeah, I, I figured there wasn't. Yeah, do you do you like want me to 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 like make like <laughs> make catastrophe start happening again or something? What what are you gonna ask me next? <laughs> oh, and, like, and he's he 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 is he is gonna kind of kind of like briefly be be broken from the kind of you know thinking and like panic state, kind of having to, to kind of smile. Oh, it, if you could do that, that would be wonderful. This would be about the time. Uh, yep. One catastrophe coming down of this sea structure, bro. <sighs> kind of like shrugs. <laughs> uh, I. If any of them come out, I don't think I. I don't think any of them are gonna like me anymore. Oh, you're abandoning you. I'm here. They're not. God damn it, Blizzard. I. You wanted you, you talk to me about everything that was at stake if I died, and then you're mad when I come back. Well, look, I'm not exactly mad, okay? I, you know, I'd rather have you than them, okay? That's for sure. Don't tell them that. But what the hell? I, I, I think that's. I, I'm sure they can understand that from a logical perspective. But. You know what? We have a contract. I haven't seen anything mind warp become out of the structure yet, so I think we'll just wait until tomorrow now. Oh. Uh. Um, this is so, uh, a problem. Want something to eat? And as he says that, boom! You guys all see like a big ass fucking beam, like as the sea structure activates for a third time now. <laughs> It's like holy shit! So and then we something like inside. that. <laughs> <laughs> then we got back to the structure. As you guys see, the guy like, you know, pull some some like uh, levers, turn some fucking knobs, do do a few button presses, and then it starts charging up. The obelisk begins getting um once again lighting up with these circuit like lines around it, and uh, eventually it reaches the top of the chamber. And uh, you see, he's like, and with this, my dominion is now complete. Click. Holy Boom. shit, bro, did that domain expansion? Shut the, the fuck, fuck up. <laughs> 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 and you see that from the obelisk, right? Starts like radiating this sort of blue, like vibrant energy. And the tubes that are connecting the obelisk to the pad with the glass um, tube around it start like flowing this blue liquid back out. And it fills the bottom of the pad and then the grids, like between the panels. And you can see this ethereal blue substance starts swirling and solidifying into a form into a person. It stops a little short of what you expected. Um, the person is about a meter tall. The person is a child. <laughs> oh. I'm awake. What? Bro, I was about to say, keep it away from Karagi. Bro, come on. Karagi, put your dick back in your pants. God damn it, guys. I didn't even say anything. I didn't even say anything. Yeah, super. stop with the jokes, man. That shit's gross. I didn't even say anything. So, you can see it's a child, uh, Pythia. Pythia child, like a snake. Uh, he has white hair, somewhat unkempt. Uh, both of his eyes are bright purple, like like you know, like one of the eyes of the of the general dude, right? Uh, pointy ears, scales around his like jaw and frontal neck area, um, and uh, he seems to be like wearing a very finely made white suit. And uh, the boss baby. you see, he just kind of, like looks around, um. 
you see he's, he could be like about eight, right? Like eight to nine years old. Um, this guy like looks around very like, obviously confused, right? But generally having an air of like calmness, right? Um, but what? It's a kid. The guy just materialized a kid. And, uh... It also said, like, with this, so the kid is the fucking super weapon. Like, that's what he's gonna take the world with? Yeah, and... What do you guys... What do you guys fucking, like... What's your reaction to this? I'm just looking at this like, what the fuck am I saying? Am I happy? Yeah, I'm, I'm clapping. I'm clapping, like applauding the, the marvelous thing I've I just I will seen. join in clapping after I notice uh, Chaser starts <laughs> doing it. I'm bochi wiggling. Oh. What does that mean? I'm just mm. having a spaz attack. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and you see... Ramio just kind of like go over and be like, yes, this should have been it. With this, I will be able to. And as he like rounds the pillar to look at the kid, he's like, what the fuck? I, I invoked the original administrator, not a mewling newt. What the hell is this? Was this not your desired goal, Your Grace? Yeah, is, there, is this not child. what was supposed to happen? <laughs> what a dumbass. Why would I want to summon a child? I don't know, maybe it's a super powerful like you. Maybe a little less. Perhaps there yeah, was like, an error. He looks at you like he, he looks at you like he's one moment away from fucking dematerializing when you say it can't be as powerful as you. <laughs> yeah, then I say maybe a little less. You know, I say maybe a little less. <laughs> Forgive his ignorance as he speaks out of turn. Yo, could I could I if, could I go up could I go up to the, the the child and just like pat its head? Well you can definitely not right now. You're quite far away. Fuck. <laughs> could I if, approach if, it, as approach I see the child. as I see Kuroko try to step up, especially after child. Chaser fucking just said that shit, I I'm I'm gonna like try to grab Kuroko's arm and like pull her mm -hmm. back, like no! the fuck are you doing? But it's so cute. But it's so cute. Bro, I have I the desire to, to pat it. You know what? No matter. No matter. I will just destroy it and try again. I just need more time. <laughs> Please let me touch it at once. Very well, you grace. Okay, so the man is about to go and kill a child. I don't know if any of you want to try to do something about that. I want to do something. I want to stop this. I, I want Look, to I've the seen child. so many kids die over at Iberia. It doesn't bother me anymore. So like, I know, yeah. like it's fine. <laughs> Kuroko is the moral fucking like person for once. Okay, Kuroko, what do you want to do? <laughs> I want to stand in front and block him with my arms stretched out. Like, wait, you can't pause. You can't pause. Time. You can't no, make wanna... it there in time. No. Can I shout? Can I say something? You're an artificer. Don't you have spells? Can't you, like, shoot him with something? <laughs> I'm still gonna attempt what, to shoot stop. Shoot him! I don't wanna... Uh, I just get him polarized. I don't wanna oh, fucking pull it. Oh. I'm gonna still attempt you know what? to stop. I will I say... Attack him. I will say with a dash you can get in his way. And uh, Sebas, you're trying to stop her. I guess it's contested athletics again. But what if I made... Hold... <laughs> Fuck. Uh. Okay. Just for only oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! <laughs> I win! No fucking hold way! Up, hold on, hold on. I, I want to. Uh, no, 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 there's no, no fucking way. way. I, I want to do go. one more thing hell. before okay. Kuroko even gets there. I didn't uh -huh. want to do this, but I'm going to. I'm going to play my Pipes of Haunting. This will not damage you. 
But I'm gonna attempt to I frighten. I you don't have time. Uh, I don't I have time to, to be frighten. An you already, yeah, you went up to like try and grab her. She like slipped out and like, you need to like go in and pull out your pipes of holding and start playing them. She will Fuck. get in front of his way before that. All right, well, mm -hmm. that's a shame. So yeah, you just get in front of this like massive, like goalish military, like intimidating as fuck, dude. Um, oh, we're also haven't updated, see. That's weird. Refresh your roll 20, maybe? Anyhow, um, so they did an athletics check, and as you know, both of them are weak as fuck. So Kuroko rolled a 5, and Sebas rolled a 3. So... <laughs> Not a very strong boy. Do any of us have good strength? No. No, we literally all yeah. went charisma classes. Yup. To be fair, half of the By book the way, is charisma-based classes. Just, like, I think... We forgot about someone. Emerald is also with Blizzard. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I've been wondering, isn't there a fifth? With oh, us? yeah. <laughs> that's on Skorak. All right, that's on fucking Skorak for not... Yeah, that's on Skorak. Because Emerald every never... Every time we went to those rooms, she just kind of just was like... She kind of just like shut down, like NPC shut down, window shut just down. Exist. Every time we delivered the things. Exists. It's well, funny pissed. because she is actually an important character. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm pissed um, now. <laughs> I'm fucking mad. You are you are pissed. Yeah, Sebo say Martin is pissed. Uh, Kuroko, you get in front of the guy. What do you do? I'm gonna I'm gonna persuade him to reconsider. Hey, oh, there. actually, what? hold up. Have my rolls on the other screen? Not. Uh, yeah, I don't think yeah. they have. Yeah. That's tough. That's tough. Yeah, they have. I don't think what are you saying going to God, I, but I you can just be like, to I tried to kill a child. Okay, what do you say? <laughs> okay, okay. I rolled persuasion. Uh, <laughs> my lord, my liege, my grace. Uh, I feel like this is a bit of an over exaggeration we uh i know what you were trying to do was not to your liking but uh as you can see it's 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 just a it's just a child question mark but you know surely you could spare this one and you could maybe make another one over exaggeration <laughs> Do you know how much Elysium I poured into this? Uh, I am getting it back. Uh, I mean, surely there's another option. Yeah, you know. My lord, forgive this filth, for she knows not. Filth? Oh, shut your mouth! Get out of my way. I no longer have association but... with this one. Okay. Yes, we're uh, like, way I see it, that's a failure. Me lord has the right to do whatever they want with it. Well said, Chaser. On. That is a failure. There, and there's... as such, it should be disposed of. Is there I really not... I won't go that fucking far, there's... don't need to fucking persuade him to do it. There's nothing, there, there's no changing your mind, my lord. He will just again here, raise his arm and smack you out of the way. Bruh. Please. How much damage is that? <laughs> um, to be fair, uh, it, it, as uh, okay, quick quick little D&D thing. If you're just hitting someone and without the intent to really physically bodily harm them, it should not be a damage roll. Just still heads up to anyone at home, too. Uh, damage mm -hmm. is like, damage to your HP is people something actively killing you. Yep. But, because of who he is, right? Okay. Um, this will, you know, I try to do you a favor, Karagi. <laughs> I try to. Well, it's a bitch smack, right? So he's going to be like as weak as it can be for him. Hmm? You just make it flat damage. Be nice. Yeah, what? it's flat damage. Yeah, okay. That, it's not gonna be that. That definitely hit. Um, 
that hits. That's a that's to hit. Oh. Like, it doesn't auto hit, no matter what. Like you know. <laughs> uh, I figured if it was a bitch slap, you know. Whatever. Yeah, Go no, on. It, it doesn't auto. Go off. Uh, it's four damage. four damage. So you take four damage and are basically so just. I'm at six H lap on the way. And yeah, so he kind of like goes up and he's like, no mother, I have time. And neither Eden, nor the adjudicators, not fucking Bluethorn, are ever going to be able to stop me. And he just grabs the kid by the head and you see his eyes start glowing. And then his arm starts disintegrating. And you see kind of like, looks at it, looks at the kid, looks at it. What the? And you see just, like his whole body just blows away into fucking dust. Then bro, well, the bro child was taking control of the damage, what the hell? <laughs> yes, let's go! Yes! The child, he built Thorn Mail, he's playing Ramus. No one understands my being joke. Uh, I'm gonna, uh, very, very calmly, very calmly, um, get, like, walk over to, uh, if I'm able to, right? Hopefully I'm not stopped, but I'm just gonna walk over to the, um, west door. With zero ill intent. Actually. Um. All right. Okay, am I stopped? Well, you do hear that there is a lot of commotion going on. And, um... Oh, lots of footsteps. Lots yeah. of footsteps coming into this room from west, east, north. <laughs> okay, okay. I, I shall uh, then just kind of wait by the, by the steps. Hearing this. And, uh, you see the kid looks at you, Kuroko. Yeah. Just kind of walks up to you. Yep. What then? What do you guys do? <laughs> I'm, I'm waiting know. on the... the I'm waiting the on the... child the, approaches the me, steps. and I'm just like, and I'm just like, huh? Weren't you supposed to die? Uh, I'm still pretty surprised that the DNR OC just got uh, pulverized back. Mm -hmm. Did the eye also get pulverized? Yes, the eye also got pulverized. Did you really want that eye for your seaboard? No, that was that was missed I mean, yeah, out content. He wanted it. <laughs> he wasn't able to do it. He missed out on that content. Ah well. Yeah. Next place. Yeah, it's okay. Um, some sort of alarm is going off. You would imagine the people stationed in the other rooms are probably heading here right now. Your move, everyone. Um, we take the kid and get out. Actually, yeah. Is the is the door that was closed before? Is that has that changed at all? Um, so the doors north, west, and east are closed, and the south one. But you would imagine nothing is holding them closed anymore. Uh, Not locked or anything. You can just open them. Yeah. So you guys grab the kid. So I'm going to try to read the situation here. Mm -hmm. And just say, so we run or we play it off? Uh, yeah. We're running. Got it. Could I grab the kid and we head out. Me? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to start sprinting back guard. over to the, to the fucking Yeah, you're door. the only oh. one that defended him. He likes you now. What? I don't even like his mom. You're like his mom. Stop bickering now. Okay, you know what? I'm locked in. I'm locked in. I'm locked in. Guys, say less, say less, say less, say less. All and right, you guys you basically uh, start running. And as you run, you don't make it to the door before the door from the west opens because the guys were right there, right? And you see like two people. Um, you know, these people that uh, Chaser said, being like, freeze! And they, like, raise crossbows. And then you see a scythe. Scythe? Reach out. 
yes, over their necks, like from behind them, right? And just pull and decapitate both in one swing. This child might be a little more trouble than it's worth. Oh my god, it's Yui from SAO. Just go, just go, just go, and just from go. The doorway, exit saw Caprine girl with huh? bluish, like light bluish hair. Uh, a gray raincoat and a massive scythe that looks to have eyes all over its length. And she looks at you what and you guys music? read her name tag. That's her music. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and you read Damn, her name music. tag. Agent Karen from Eden Logistics. <laughs> And then you fucking sprint through the door. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, as we're sprinting through the door, I guess we're going to just sprint on our, our happy asses out of there. Um, yep, you just run, bolt out of the fucking door. Okay, and also, <laughs> as I'm doing that, I am making sure I have my uh, my pipes of haunting equipped. Fair, fair. You have them in your fucking hands as you're, like, running. <laughs> yep. Yes, Agent Karen of Eden Logistics. Okay, uh... Dang it, I'll need you to write that right down, uh, by trail. the way. <laughs> Skorak, I'm gonna need you to write that down later. Uh, sure. Yeah. So, uh, you guys exit out of the, out of the thing in Blizzard. Um... You know that something is going on there. Like, alarms are started blaring, fucking, like, footsteps. Um, you did see, like, a like a figure, like, almost like a silhouette, right? Like, off in the horizon, enter the building from one of the other, like, buildings. But you, you know who the fuck that is, right? From one of the other, like, entrances. Hmm? But that happened a little while. I, 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 I imagine they, I imagine they were, like, about to just leave when they saw the thing shoot up into the sky. Yes, you you just see all of them sprinting out and Kuroko under her fucking arm as this unknown child. <laughs> okay, damn, that was fucking that was that was quick. I thought I thought I, I thought I was gonna need to like try and try and get the like caravan people to like hey give them like ten minutes then we can go. But uh, apparently they were fucking they were out quick. For that. Yeah, so you guys see Blizzard out there with the caravan, and you just run, and what do you say? <laughs> to get everyone to just fucking leave. <laughs> yeah, which... We are out. Let, let, let's head out. We're done here. Goodbye to this place. Let's head back. Okay, um, I'm gonna uh, relay urgently oh, yeah. the situation and to, uh, to our guide. Mm-hmm. Um, and then, uh, I'm gonna lean in over to Emerald. Very, uh -huh. and very quietly whisper, uh, so, when Blizzard ran out of the door, what did he proceed to do and say after? Neo, thank you for the 20! Neo, Skorak, you can't hide, that was Nayu from us, I see. <laughs> now nah, who's who's now you? I know I never heard of any now you. Not that. Oh That's God. nobody, guys. Nah, nobody. This is just Morax new Deviant Art OC because he lost his other one. Yeah. See <laughs> ya and uh, immediately spawned. Uh, uh, it's Neo. This is half Neo. What are you talking about? Who's yeah, guys? It's it's nothing. You know, really. <laughs> okay. So uh, right, I'm gonna lean in. So I I asked Emerald that right. Yeah. Um, I mean, all of you are here, so Larissa, right, is getting the fucking thing ready to go. Yeah. You guys look very eager to go, so she doesn't, you know, yeah. she doesn't care. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I'm, I'm leaning in, though. Uh, yeah, what are you doing? You're saying, you're saying. Mm -hmm. Emerald? Yeah? I, I already asked my fucking question. What did Blizzard what do you say and do after he ran out at door? Uh, nothing much. I mean, he just came back here and uh, he seemed came to like, back make here. conversation with Marisa. Did he go, did he go did he directly run? back there? Did he say Oh, yeah, anything? immediately. Okay. So immediately. All right. Good. Yeah. No. Um, just, did just he, immediately, yeah. Was he saying he anything? I feel like he. I, I heard him yelling something 
as he was leaving of uh I'll remember you later or something for your great what was it again? Oh no, I, I, that wasn't no, I said that was under him. his breath. He that was that yeah, was, that was, was under breath. his breath oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. as okay, he was okay, like okay. leaving. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he so, all right. so I thought I thought you were saying that shit, but all right. Yeah, um, no, 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 no. He didn't. He didn't actually just be like, "Hey guys, see you later, sucker." <laughs> and, yeah, yeah. It was I, like you know, it, if I the, achieve what I want to, I'll remember you later. Did Did he explain to you why he was running, or he just ran? I think he just he was running because we were all running. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, what did he say to to what's her Larissa? Larissa. Uh, was she even like was 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 the was, was the little whatever whatever emerald is even there? I mean, yeah. no, look, look, over. look, if you wanna if you want if you wanna ask if he was encouraging Larissa to leave, no, he wasn't encouraging Larissa to leave. Got it. Okay, so I know to not beat him yes, to death. Yes, back me up. <laughs> okay, back me up, Mover. Appreciate you for telling me this, friendo. I was nudge. actively asked. I was actively asking if there was anything we could do to help. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, you guys uh I imagine just dive into the fucking carts and they start fucking moving. <laughs> um and you do see like as the carts are starting to move, the entrance from which you left is starting to freeze over. Like you see like the like ice spread through the walls and start like going like wider and wider. Hmm? And that's probably I imagine bad. You guys start, you go, and as you start moving, the entrance just breaks open and splinters. Um, oh, shit. I forgot to set up the, the, the repeat for that theme. Action I, movie I need to remember I need to do it in every, every theme. Yep. Every time I switch tracks. Hmm? Yep. Okay. Uh, do you also want to change our, uh, our background, too? Uh, yes, uh, I suppose we do need to change the background on this particular one. You guys back are to back the to the desert. Back to the desert, baby. <laughs> and you see this? The same fucking person with the raincoat, the same Caprina with the raincoat, kind of like, walk out from like the, the, the broken, frozen thing, and just kind of like, shield her eyes from the sun and look at you, leave, and it's like, ah, dang it. <laughs> and, uh, that's the first time you see her, Blizzard. <laughs> But you know, you don't get a good look at her as you guys are basically. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can I just see goat. Uh, you just see goat. Mm -hmm. A few minutes pass. And, um. I imagine all of you probably don't say anything in the beginning of this. <laughs> in the beginning of this journey. It's been a day, okay? It's yeah, been a day. Yeah, yeah I'm just catching day. my breath with like the sea born in my lap. I'm just catching my breath. Is is the is the young man still with us? Um, yes, the kid is with you. You guys took him with you, so he wouldn't have gone anywhere. He's mom. <laughs> yeah, I'm his mom now. He is on my lap. Yeah, you know, like probably more, she probably likes her more than you who called him a failure repeatedly. <laughs> yeah, 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 absolutely. Yes, yes, yeah. this is it. Yes. So yeah. All right, well, you know, at least you break the got no reason to hate me. Uh, well, no, no, yes he does. Yes he does. He has reason to hate. Yeah, yeah. He well he all said. he saw, <laughs> all he saw was me, just. You were having a hand out him, for so. nope. I never opted in to kill him. Agree with Chaser. Say well said to him being a yeah. You are yeah. What is, me. Yeah. <laughs> what is this cap? <laughs> you guys yeah, are just no. trying oh, no, 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 to no, no. save your we, ass. We secretly agreed together. We never said that shit out loud because it's you, stupid. You, def you basically like try to stop her from stopping him. <laughs> Yeah, but in terms of how that's perceived, no, 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 don't give me that shit. No, no this kid, yeah, this no, kid no, no, should, should not be, should be, be like you. Out of you. Wait, I just got a super secret weapon as a, like, my, yeah, let's go. Never not as much as Chaser, but you know. You hit my mama. So, uh, oh, you guys go, so... and, uh, so, uh, you see, like, uh, after, like, a little bit when you guys, like, de-fucking pressurize from that situation, uh, you see... Uh, <clears throat> uh kind of like uh I, I i have several questions yeah you see like everyone's like so uh 
Who? Yeah. Who? Uh. Oh. So, what's up with the kid? Child. <laughs> you know, child. Can we honestly save uh, this conversation for perhaps? Not now. Not today. Yeah. I'm kind of kaput. You know? Um. I think you guys can wait a bit, especially after leaving us. Okay, all of us tried to go out that door, okay? What did you want us to do? Open it? How? No, I expected you to at least, I don't know, maybe investigate around to see if there was any mechanism, or maybe try the terminal. Mechanism? The man moved his hand towards the door and it closed. Oh, yeah, so you knew how it worked, tested it out, took at least a, a minute, right? Like, you, you, you gave us the thought. You didn't just keep running, right? Right, right? You didn't just continue running from that door to the to to the outside. Didn't give us a, okay. a single thought. We we tried to get as far away Appreciate from the, the fucking content. demigod guy. From what you told me However, earlier, he didn't tell you anything, he just started running. You followed. Didn't ask any questions. Which is fair enough, I'm you less tried mad to at save you. Your own skin. What, what, what questions? Like, oh, how quickly do you think he's going to disintegrate them? Like, what? So what we you, were hey, already hold dead. Hey, hey, hang on, Skorak. Uh, Blizzard never told Emerald what the fuck was happening. Blizzard just ran. Emerald no, also Skorak was not never informed me that she was there. Yeah, she, yeah, she was also not there. I'm assuming she just I got no lost and was in there. that main fucking chamber, right? <laughs> Or not, yes. uh, just yeah. outside of the chamber or something, right? Sure. Just didn't follow yeah, us she, in, she so. Was like in the, she was in the fucking, uh, like, you know. In, in that square. Fountain. In that little fountain square, yeah. So, no, bullshit. She didn't fucking know what the fuck was going on. That's what I have to say to that shit. Again, I am hey, less look, mad. Non-temporal, non-temporal teammates aside. <laughs> I... I'm I'm less I'm not mad with you, friend though. No 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 no. I'm I'm mad at this one over here. Who didn't even think for a second, hey, why don't I stop? Why don't I check? No no not even a, a spare thought. Just How kept running. Know that? How do I know that? I asked. Because at least I got friends I trust. Is it gonna, was it gonna make a mental note of be very careful what you say or when Emerald is around? Uh, I'm sorry that in this high pressure situation, I froze up and saved a life that I knew I could instead of the ones that I didn't know I could. Yours. <laughs> Mine and hers. Referring to right. Emerald. I doubt you weren't even thinking about Emerald when you ran. Exactly. Skorak, where was she? She was basically just like rummaging around the like, uh, you know, fountain area. Mind if I make a little, uh, what's it called? Fuck, what's it called? What? Oh my god. Like. It's, it's the word for, like, making a change to something. It's like, it originally wasn't the retcon, because I didn't know she was there, because I wasn't told. I didn't know she was in there uh, either, I'll be honest. <laughs> yeah, no, Skorak, you no, really, you Skorak. really screwed the pooch on this one. <laughs> no, like, it 100% would have yelled to run. That changes there. the story, like, that, then, that, by that the way. Yell, like, Our prior conversation yell, would not be the same. Yeah. It's like, if, I, if if I'm going by there, I'm gonna say that. If I if she's there... Okay. If this, not, if this non-corporeal being has, like, appeared and disappeared... All right, whatever. Let's let's move past this yeah, conversation. Nothing's, is nothing's like coming out. Of it. Super position. Uh, the, no, nothing's uh, coming out of the uh, conversation. So let's um, pass it. This song is very loud on my end. Oh really? I mean, yeah, hey, you guys are not uh, hard, you guys hard. are not with the goat. Uh, yeah, I'm like, please, so fucking please it. change it. This is not an appropriate song please, for this. Please, please. <laughs>
<laughs> this is way too intense for this conversation. Yeah, seriously. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Right, well, you guys can afford to wait. Just let us, you know, collect ourselves for a moment. Bare minimum. That's all right. And I want to say, genuinely, I'm sorry. I... I have problems in these types of situations. Should have done more. There was probably more I could have done. You know I'm what? I'm going to say something. In your defense, these these assholes next to me re referring to uh, uh, fucking... Blue, uh, fucking... Chaser and Sebus. Yeah, Sebus and... Chaser and Sebus. They were all, all for uh, killing you guys. I'm just going to say that. We never said anything we about killing Blizzard. Nah, not not them, not killing him specifically, but uh, joining the winning side. So if you want to save your life, that's fine. That's I'm, I'm I'll, I'll accept your apology. But I won't excuse these fellas. Oh, so you won't excuse me we all, we all for saving your life, huh? While you saving my there. life. Oh, please, please, let's let's oh, walk God. it back again. If you, if I hadn't told you to follow my lead and, you know, listen to the briefing that Na gave us to play into his ego, unless you both forgot, then we wouldn't have walked out of there unscathed. In my defense, Don't forget I who talked I our way through this. In my defense, I would have cowered in fear anyway and would have... <laughs> I'm just playing into my own ego. I would have. Uh... Like Karagi, your defense is literally in my defense. I'm a, your honor. I'm a fucking pussy. Yeah, I would have. I, I would have. I would have done anything to survive too. So, well, then maybe value your ego a little bit less, and think about your teammates, and watch your words. I genuinely <laughs> tried to save all three of you, or all three of us. The That's best thing I could have done, and the best thing I thought up of at the time. You had a better idea, That's... by all means. That's rich coming from someone that would have sacrificed his whole his whole company, but. That's a, that's a all right. So uh, okay, wait, 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 wait. Where, where, where exactly are are, are are like you guys sitting in this like kind of caravan cart carriage thing? I imagine it's Chaser and me, and Emerald sitting yeah. next to each yeah. other, and then you three on oh, the other okay, side. Okay. And I, yep, got, and the, I got I got he, the nameless boy on my lap. <laughs> he's just yep. bumble. He's just not saying anything. Okay. Yeah, he's okay. he's being very quiet for all of this. <laughs> I don't. The fuck was that? I don't really have any good way to create any kind of barrier, so I, so I, I am going to to, to kind of je, je, gesture gesture over to to, uh, to 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 Chaser and ask Chaser, you mind you mind standing up for a moment? Stand okay. up this thing. I stand up. <laughs> so, all right, stand, and 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 he's he's gonna kind of move aside. Stand in the middle. Between, it's like, it's like, so I imagine they're sitting on like opposite ends. So like, they're lying. Oh, between Kuroko and Sebus. Like, <laughs> like, like, yeah, yeah, just, just stand between them for a little while. At least break their line of sight. Huh, so fine, all fine. No, oh, Chaser, you don't Let's have to do this. Breath. This is ridiculous. This is childish. Yeah, Sit back well, down, Chaser. Like, what is the point here? We're supposed to be working together. Bro, bro. Blood's and gonna, you, we're, we're I, in the car, right? Blood is gonna. Yes, be, yeah, we are. We are. So it's like Blood you want to openly nice. start having secret conversations in front of us. If you're it's asking for forgiveness, why are you already acting like this? This makes me less inclined no, I to believe this is about you. A, a secret that's clearly conversation. not that's what about I was Blizzard saying. Not, yeah, that's about Blizzard not wanting you two to fucking start killing each other. <laughs> yeah, that's like. A, Oh, Putin please, Chase that as a barrier. This, this so little demon is gonna eat each, each other. I'm not kill, gonna. Kill him. I'm not gonna harm anyone. Not so barbaric. I use my words. I, I, that's all I've been calling you guys this whole this whole time. So I'm just giggling. I'm just. I'm just chuckling right, to myself. So <sighs> let's just take a deep breath. And you know, 
this was a success. They sent us here to fucking die. And we got out with formation intact and with a living fucking whatever the fuck that is. Hey, like, that's. I, wait, well, he doesn't even have a name. I'm, I'm not going to say anything. He doesn't Actually, know. about that, are we going to give it a name? I get to name it. I get to yeah, name it. Yeah, yeah, that's Why fair. Why don't you guys, you guys it. try fair. to talk to them first and stop referring to them as it? Yeah, you. Anyhow, uh, hi, or do you understand us? I'm going to look at it. Diamond, I'm you doing it now. <laughs> I did it, I did it out of character. I did it out of character. It was fine. Mm -hmm. it's fine. Nods. Are you able to talk? Opens mouth. Closes mouth. Shakes head. <laughs> well, um, you have a name, right? Shrugs. <laughs> yeah, all right, Kuroko, go nuts. Okay, okay, back off there, you brute. All right, I, I pick him up. How, how tall is this little lad? Uh, like about a meter tall. Okay, I pick him up by the pits and make him look at me. All right, little buddy. So, uh... Mm. Do you treat all children mm. as pets? What do you mean? Clearly, you have no interaction with children. Actually, I do. You see, Emerald just got scratched his You know, we found him in a C structure. Why not just call him C? No, 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 no. That's that gives him. That's very, not very creative, and it's also probably He's bright traumatic blue, for right? him. Bro's huh? glowing. Bro's glowing. He's like. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Can you describe him one more time, briefly? Uh, white hair. Uh, purple, very like bright purple eyes, um, you know, pointy ears, snake tail, white scales like going like in the front of his neck and his jaw. Uh, very well made. Campaign suit. have white hair. What the fuck? Well, you know, he kind of reminds me of uh, what parts of the sky look like. Why not just name him uh, CL? <laughs> ah, tie into uh, another creator. Haha, -ha. but umps. Ah. Mm, let's see. Since I'm the one that defended him, I would say give him more dignified name. You can actually like, think of dignified names. Of course, of course. You think too lowly of me. For Please, by all means, surprise me. Surprise me. Go for it. How about Noah? How about Neo? Uh, for, for, <laughs> for legal reasons, Noah is the name of one of the players on the Fate Harmacy Sunday stream, so I would prefer it was not Noah. <laughs> hey, how's about, how's about Neo, you know, or, or one of our... Neo! You know what? <laughs> Do it. I'll okay, call so start naming the children after people in the chat. Yeah, no, and no, then no, Neo no. just recently d donated. Come on, why not? It'd be great. Neo, you're gonna be, <laughs> you should be part of the story. I'm not against it. I'm not against it. How about Nemo? <laughs> Oh come on, man! Like you went no way, Nemo. No, no, like let let it be, no, let it be Neo. Nemo is not as good as Neo. <laughs> come on. I mean, I think Neo's sense. earned this. Like, fine, we'll compromise with Neo. Sweet, thank you. Tori is a cooler name. Very true, Tori. Tori, Tori is also another fucking oh, NPC from I'm the a, previous a, campaign, so... I'm a Tori. <laughs> well, I, I didn't oh, watch the previous campaign, so I wouldn't know any of that. Yeah. Alright. Okay, Neo. I guess you guys are naming the, the kid Neo. <laughs> we are. There you, you go, Neo. Paul. Okay. Yeah, it makes sense. Doesn't Neo mean, like, new? Yeah, it means new. Yeah. The new life that we just found. <laughs> He's gonna be my well, Digimon. Uh, sorry, oh. Laffy. Uh, Neo also recently donated during the session, so yeah, uh, you know, a little bit did. of love right there. A little bit of, you know, we engage with you guys, so 100%. You know what that means? Donate uh -huh. more money pay, to the harmacist. Pay money so that you can pay be money a to be part of the campaign. <laughs> Hey, we're screen guy now. You guys have uh, like 50% more chances to be a child in this campaign. <laughs> Twice as likely to become a child. Congratulations. So it's Aleph. Congratulations. 
So just so just donate money, and you can <laughs> we'll name you an NPC yeah, randomly. Yeah. Yeah. And Skorak will make you a semi-significant part of the story. <laughs> He'll have to work around it somehow. Under penalty of death. Yeah. I'll have to. I'll have to fucking figure out how the. He's got to. He's got to work for those donations. So you know, if you donate, he'll he'll work it in. He'll, uh, he'll... Well, he, he, I was like, I was like, it's baby steps. First score act. Just remember, Emerald exists for a session. Yeah, you know. Remember the baby like steps. fifth member of your group that is like a very integral NPC. Exit. <laughs> okay, who's who keeps fucking like? like that's my notification that's sound that, that's, on my phone. Yeah. That's my, that's my phone. That's my phone notification. Oh, apparently Neo's also donated. Why? every stream what the fuck neo is like the biggest like donator here well like, and then it makes shit, the most neo sense has... that neo gets the name yeah. okay <laughs> all right let's yep. move on neo let's move on child. although neo i don't know gulag has been catching up lately on the on the fate pharmacy streams <laughs> all right all right come on okay so uh you guys are here with the kid who you named neo uh and do you wish to discuss anything more? <laughs> uh, Neo, well, every can discussion you is gonna go. Tell us anything about that place that you, well, materialized into. Anything Clearly, he can can't remember? talk. I can give him a piece of paper, and he can uh, write down yeah, anything. Yeah. I was gonna say it. I do carry a notepad. Yeah, hundred percent. I have a notepad. Oh yeah, you feel notepad. Yeah, so I'll, I'll, I'll uh, does you know. He, does he even know how to write? We'll find out. <laughs> I'll see. Look, someone's, like, that notification sound like, sounds like someone's like, what's the opposite of blowing your nose? Sniffing? No, snorting. Sniffing. Um, snorting, yeah. Yeah, sniffing. Like, snorting, like, very loudly. Can you, like, not? <laughs> I don't think that, I don't oh, think Oh, I thought was somebody was actually, uh, blowing. doing that. Oh shit, I actually... Oh, yeah. I was blowing no, my nose. No, I was no, blowing no. my nose. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. No, I, I was like... Was actually yeah, I'm like, I, I thought somebody was actually, like, blowing their nose. What the f okay. Uh, yeah, so I, I hand I him the... I thought someone was blowing their nose, too, yeah, but, like, you know. I, I hand him the, uh, the notepad and, uh, you know, pen. Okay. And, uh, you ask him if he remembers about that place? Well, uh, what his memories are. He just writes no. <laughs> okay. Well. That's a good boy. I'm, I'm out of options for right this second. Uh, yeah, why don't you guys try something? Um, I mean, I don't necessarily have a question for the child, but for any of you, is there anything notable about the way he looked or what happened to him, considering you're all alive and we now have a child? Well, um, I, I, quick, at least. I, I, I played into, as you heard from us arguing earlier, um, I played into that super dangerous guy's uh, ego, saved our asses, and uh, he spawned uh, this little bro. Little bro. <laughs> Talking too much like myself. <laughs> just just uh, patting him on, yeah. just patting him on the shoulder. This little bro. It's <laughs> fine, little bro. <laughs> this little guy. And, uh... Right, when he went to try to destroy this one, um, he just evaporated into nothing. So, yeah, some. Um, I mean, fucking super dangerous thought eraser guy is dead. Presumably, I mean, we don't know if he's dead or if he just dematerialized. Or I, you know, I, I don't exactly know what happens because we didn't see a corpse, and uh, at least where I'm from. You, you confirm the kill with a corpse. I, I'm pretty sure dematerialization is a pretty good confirmation for a kill, but you know, stranger things have happened. <laughs> exactly. I mean, he could have been transported somewhere instead of uh, properly dematerialized. Exactly. That's, that's what Sebas is implying, I think. So, and like, confirm a kill without a corpse. backfired? I don't know if his powers backfired. I think what happened was he... This one, Neo's stronger. We don't from even know his strength. Oh, boy. That was such a kid. <laughs> it, I could, like, our... punt him. <laughs> Do you want to try that? No, but, like, I could. Exactly. 
lest you dematerialize out of existence. Okay. So you, you you can't convince me that the kid can just dematerialize people. Hm? You weren't there. You ran. All you can do is believe me, or you have nothing. We were there. We saw it. If no it's anything, I can back up with a story. Uh, we, I just recapped it. <laughs> no, I can back up. He's saying back up. up. Oh, back, back up? Yeah, up. okay. He's saying he's Not a bad. witness. Bad. Oh. Look, all of us here saw it, all right? Again, choose to believe me, friend, or just completely ignore what I'm saying. Doesn't matter to me. And I'm his surrogate mother. Okay, a little bit of grain of salt with whatever Kuroko says, but yeah. You know I'm straight-laced for it. Okay, well, if all three of you are saying that happened, then... I'm still more inclined to believe that something else went wrong rather than, oh, the kid is stronger than him. Like, a lot of things could have happened. I mean, but if their story is... Do you to, think we stuck around long enough, happened, or...? He tried to destroy or Ramiel was uh, was around long enough to tell us what was going on? No, it went from arm missing to completely gone. Okay, um... So, question. What about the, like, girl that followed you out? Zero clue. She showed up, took no, care of some of the, the uh, some of the men, or some of the enemy forces as we were leaving. Uh, actually, uh, her name was... You didn't fucking write it down for me, by the way. The name I asked you for. Yeah, I didn't write it down, but it's, it's, it's Karen. So that's great. I still want that fucking name. I have an actual notepad where I'm writing all this shit down. You, sure, I just... Fuck, I would do it after the session. God damn it, dude. Because <laughs> <laughs> I can't recall her name, that's why. So, yeah. yeah, yeah, it's fine. I, I, I relay the name and uh, the logistics company. That I saw on the on the badge. And there we go. I, I wrote down six foot. Thank you. Yeah, it's even logistics agent Karen. So, now, Eden, adjudicators, randomly stopping us. Um, pretty sure Ramiel talked about the adjudicators in Eden. So, if uh, logic dictates anything, most likely, they're going to be part of this as well. Oh. And I'm going to, I'm going to, you know. Score. Score. Uh, um, uh, you, you, you finish first. You finish first. Oh. I'm uh, going to nonchalantly give uh, Emerald uh, the slightest nudge. After, after you know, I, I say adjudicator. Oh, fuck. Um, yeah, yeah, that, that, I think I may be, I think I may be filing my resignation after this. Hmm? Don't worry, you got uh, friends like us, as I point also at myself with my thumb, to uh, get you covered. You got friends like us, the greatest people in the business. This is the, we're, we're literally the scummiest people in the fucking, in the thing. Always remember, Emerald. Got my friends' backs. Uh, okay, but uh, this is like two out of the like big three companies like being involved in this. Like the last thing we need is fucking Trifactor also getting in. Well, right. if this is as big as we think it might be, that's probably all that's going to happen. Trifactor oh. is pulled towards power and crazy events. So. Most likely they're going to show up. God damn it. You guys understand what this means, right? Eden can and like can just go into any company they want and assign a consultant. And she does like, you know, like, you know, bunny, bunny ears, like with the fingers when she's says consultant. They have more power than God. If they know, if they want this kid and they know where this kid is going, they could literally just fully legally dissolve our company and take him. Uh, wait, what? Well, we can't have it dissolve yet. 
We still haven't gotten paid yet. Very true. Also, score at. Yes. Uh, I, as as chat has has informed my remembrance, I, I I was I was the one who rolled really well last time on knowing who the big three is. Yeah. But yeah, I have yeah. to roll again to understand like the politics, like the area, and and, and all I that. Figured that, that would I figured that would carry through. Yeah, I think okay. I can just tell you at this point. Um. So Eden Logistics is almost like the NATO of this world, but it's a company. So they are essentially, they make it their business to make sure everything is happening above board and they battle corruption, they battle like uh, under shady deals, they battle companies that get too big. So it's almost like the, they're the overall administ administrative company for all other companies, right? That's kind of what they pose as. And these shits are, they're more powerful than nations, right? Like, even could go to, like, a nation and just assassinate its leader if they wanted to. They're fucking insane. Uh, then there's the adjudicators, who are way less uh, politically powerful, but they're full-on military. They roam the wastelands between the cities, between the nations, and they make sure that, you know, the roads are clear, crime is quashed, and they just fight and fight and fight, you know? Uh, and then there's Trifactor Gang, who are the Mafia. They're just a big ass fucking mafia. <laughs> all right. So, and I assumed that I would know that all of them at the, they should all be based in. Eh, they should all they're they're all based in Minos, right? It's like where they are all at least founded. Oh, uh, no. The Eden Logistics is based in Minos. Um, the Adjudicators don't have a base. They are kind of going anywhere, and. Uh, Try Factor Gun. Uh, I mean, you, is, uh, you have to have some base of operations. Their base of they have a lot of different bases, right? But they don't have you any have like main like, bases HQ. Okay. No, they don't yeah, have yeah, a main yeah, HQ. Yeah. You know, that's, that's um, very plausible. What are you saying about Tri Factor? And uh, okay. Tri Factor is basically Syracuse. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, also, a thing that I think you would know is that a big reason why these companies became so big is that while the details are kind of murky, their founders have a lot to do with what happened 15 years ago, right? Like, people had a very strong and very, like, positive reaction to their founders because of what happened 15 years ago, which you guys wouldn't be as partial to, but you know that a lot of very powerful people trusted them and, like, gave them all their support. So these people were able to basically just build empires, like in a day, and, you know. And the and the, the 15 years ago is the sea structures pop up, sky stops moving. Yeah, sea structures stop. pop up, st sky mo stops moving, catastrophe stop. Yes. Okay. So that's why these three companies are that much above everyone else. All right. Ah. <clears throat> uh... Right, well, we have a lot to think about, and we're going to have to look out for enemies from everywhere. Yeah. Man, I, I can't wait until we fucking can. Hmm? So, I, I'm... That's probably going to be the end for, you know, the... Uh, I guess that conversation, unless anyone else wants to chime in. Yep. Unless anyone else wants to say yeah. anything, that's going to be the end for that. Blizzard is back on that meditation grind set. Kuroko is tuckered out from all that excess exercise. <laughs> all of you, like, are, are in this very cramped fucking, like, little wagon doing all of these, like, exercises and stretches. It's like, I'm stomped. Damn it, you're... You... <laughs> yeah, no. No, no. I, even I know it's probably cramped. <laughs> So, uh, so yeah. uh, like, I guess we, I, we keep going until, there. until camp. Um, I, I mean, I don't so think we... So even logistics is, is a bunch of... It's basically like if Calcid was given infinite power to make, like, the most powerful company that she could, you know? Calcid's evil. Spoilers. Calcid is Never evil. Never said even logistics Calcid. is good. <laughs> Calcid. Calcid genocided a race of people like several times. 
the same race, actually. See, the difference is Eden Logistics would have only needed one. <laughs> yeah. Eesh. So, you guys uh, kind of like continue moving and eventually you camp, right, for the night. Uh, as you did when you were going to the sea structure, it takes about the same amount of time. Uh, once again, Larissa sets everything, the Rust Hammer's also like set up, and you are left with your thoughts, I suppose. <laughs> Is everyone in Eden Logistics monologue? <laughs> Bro, that's that's why the logistics is so powerful. Nobody can, Nobody can survive. Nobody can survive their monologues. <laughs> They're yapping. Well, I, I guess if anything, no, it's just been so long. I, if any, I'm I'm waiting to get back. The blue thorn appraisals. You'll see, like, uh, Emerald is gonna go, like, sit with you and just kind of, like, offer you, like, a, like a bowl of soup that the Rastammer's made. I shall enjoy the soup. Hey, mm. uh, this is just a characteristic of mine. Uh, I'm gonna just do this real quick. Just, uh, use perception on the soup. I'm that paranoid enough, of a motherfucker. Enough. Okay, yeah, that makes sense, that makes sense. Wow. Hey, you know, 20 perception, eat soup, right? Nothing okay. wrong with it. <laughs> uh, just gonna drink soup. Uh, who are the founders? Ooh. I mean, if anyone from the players would want to know, that would be a history to learn, like, who the, the top, top brass are. Hmm? Don't I already know top brass of one of them? Um, which one? I, which, maybe I shouldn't say that out loud. Yeah, I guess. Uh, but I don't think you would. Either. Like, top brass is top brass, you know? Alright, I'm gonna try to go up the... Ch I'm gonna just see what I can figure out, too. I'll do, uh, history, you said? Yes, history. Wow, I'm rolling good today. I, I okay, don't I see did it. Did my roll 20, please? I rolled a 21. Yeah. Oh, I didn't roll a 21, I have 21. Okay, let me, let me check. Roll 20. Oh, no. Now it's 20. It, it's updated. I just got to refresh my roll 20. Yeah, there it goes. I just 20. had to refresh my roll 20. Yeah. Chose it on stream. Okay, 21. Nice. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, so we're 21. I will say you kind of know. So for Eden Logistics, it's the easiest one. Uh, the president, like the person who actually owns the component, is a woman named Lamed. But the CEO, who is the person that kind of like runs it, is a man named Echo. Uh, so Lamed actually owns it. It's technically hers, but Echo runs it. Uh, the fuck that bastard for... not dead yet. So the adjudicators, uh, the grand, the grand adjudicator, is a man named Warband, and uh, his left and right hand, like uh, like the the supreme adjudicators, are. Uh, the ones that um, Emerald actually mentioned, uh, Juniper and Spike. These are like the three like big ones for that. And the Tri-Factor Gang is like very difficult, right? Like even you would be like, you don't know, the, the leaders are incredibly secretive, right? Mayhaps. Nope, oh. never mind. Um, that wasn't even me. That's only thing was. you know Cow. is that there are three leaders that are working in conjunction, right? And at least in the very, like, you know, in the in the street level, they are known of, of as rumors, like myths. People don't know if they're real or they're just like a like a smoke screen that Tri-Factor puts up, right? Like, somewhere like the three leaders don't even exist, right? Um, their code names, right, are Wings, Fangs, and horns. So one of them, uh, they refer to him as wings, one of them they refer to him as fangs, and one of them they refer to him as horns. Why does it feel like calling a fucking Arknight's race wings would be kind of seen as, like, kind of racist? That's actually... <laughs> hey, get over here, wings! By their appendages...
I imagine everyone's writing it down. <laughs> uh, no, some... Audio is scuffed. I, I have a bit of an unfair advantage with some of these out of character, because I have seen your first serious score act. I don't remember all of it, but I have... I do I mean, know hey. some of the things. But... <laughs> it's not like I'm using that information in character, but I do yeah, know yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying, like... It's it's also meant to be like, hey, if you watch the first series, you will get some stuff, right? <laughs> hey, I'm gonna be right back. I have to take a call. Oh, okay. Somebody okay. apparently found oh, my yes. uh, my wallet. Call break. Oh. Thankfully, it's it's literally where I live, though. So it's a neighbor. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Right. Well, um, well, I think it's looking for his wallet. Uh, anybody got uh, anybody got anything to say, Chad? Hmm. Not particularly. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was I, I was writing pretty big on that history no. personally because I, I I may have actually known about those last guys that Sevis was struggling with. Oh what well, fuck the, the the YouTube thing, the YouTube thing is uh, is compressing the text. Uh, not very good. I hope you guys can understand. <laughs> What's the art yeah. of the PCs? La med. Yup. Oh, I broke my pencil. Fuck. Is just leaf juice. I mean, yeah. So it's it Warband, Wings, Fangs, Caron, and Slasher, and Neo that have new names. I don't know what you mean. These are all new original characters that have never been seen before. These are Skorax OCs. Come on. You gotta give them <laughs> a lot of respect. Yeah. <laughs> We have never seen them before. <laughs> think you thinking about you do not know the leaders of Eden Logistics. <laughs> I was I was gonna say Skorax uh, bringing up past characters is the equivalent of uh, Hoyo bringing up their past characters from their past games. <laughs> Damn. Oh God, I hate that. Shit. I really... Yeah, you guys want another I... Branya? Another Seal? Okay, in my defense, it's not, other, it's not other verse, it's literally where these characters are 15 years later. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that, that, then I should say, oh, you want Welt? Here's Welt. Literally Welt from Honkai Factory into Star Rail. Uh, Roxy, where's your butt? Uh, Neo, Ra Roxy is, is working. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna say anything because I don't know what he's doing exactly, but <laughs> you guys can... can... Just devious, so they're just deviant our recolors, they're chromas. <laughs> Wait, chromas? Oh my god, what? there was Echo in the last campaign, now there's Echo Prestige Edition. Oh yeah, true, it's it's, it's like level 20 Echo now. <laughs> it's the level one crook versus the level 100 boss. Exactly. <laughs> Okay, uh, well, score. Um, is Echo, our, our... is Echo, is, is, is Echo, is, fuck. Is Echo still depressed? That's what you, yeah. <laughs> um, you know what? I'm not gonna just say that. If, if you meet, if you guys meet them in the game, you will see what they're like. Score just has to be all of them. There's no <laughs> <laughs> You know, I, I, I mentioned them because, you know, they are important people because in the last campaign, if you know what happened, they are important people. Yeah. yeah. That doesn't mean you guys will de will certainly meet them. <laughs> that they are he was like are Kaiser hard. Kamio. Oh my, you know what? I will talk to him. I'll see if like the fucking uh he makes an appearance, his character makes an appearance if you know if he, he he's gonna be down to like play him. <laughs> Are we still uh, at at the whole uh, at the campfire? Yes, yes, you guys are still in the okay. campfire. Yes. Okay. Well, uh, you can probably take a guess at what Blizzard's doing. Score. He's he's off uh, with Larissa. 
Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Your Buila? What? What's Buila? Boys with isolated lactation access. What? what? <laughs> you gave me that. You, had, so me, you had me at lactation. So fast. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you had me at lactation. Okay, okay. Is it like beautiful Wild. women that like to ask out? Mm -hmm. Is that what that means? Dingus mm -hmm. will instantly lick ass. <laughs> what? Yeah, that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, no, I'll see what happens, because a lot of their characters are still running around. I'll see if the players ever, like, the new players ever get to meet the old players. I'll see if I'll, uh, you know, if they would be interested in making a cameo. Mm -hmm. yeah. hey, I, I could see me potentially seeing at least some of them, given my connections to... Yeah, groups. maybe. The only, the only, I don't, know how many, like, I don't know how many of them would like me. The only old PC that doesn't have uh, any, like, um, you know, relevance at this particular point is uh, Semblance, because Rip. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, that was a spoiler for fucking first campaign, yeah. wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a huge spoiler. <laughs> Okay, look, in my defense, <laughs> this is literally the second, this is literally a direct continuation of that campaign, okay? This is a direct continuation of that campaign. That's a spoiler, ah, uh, oh, that's a spoiler, one of the main characters fucking dies, oh, oh, minor spoiler. Sorry, guys. Look, okay, I, it's literally like being in episode, like, 30 and spoiling episode 20, okay? I can do that. <laughs> Spoiler, lots yeah. guns. Oh, you said Katsu right, was sorry, here. Are you still here? Katsu is not, uh, he's not as influential of a, you know, of a figure to have her, like, mentioned here. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see okay. what Katsu is doing. <laughs> Let's get back to it. All right, there we go. So, you guys kind of, like, sit down, and you see, uh, you know, Emerald just kind of, like, looking, and it's like, well, um... Any chance she could uh, divulge why you're doing this at this point? You know, really? I kind of I told you what my deal is, but, uh, you know, you seem to be pretty secretive of your own uh, stuff. The best way I can describe it is there are some very bad people who did very bad things to me, and I don't want them in the picture anymore. They're tied to one of the big three. Oh fuck! I knew it. I, I knew it. You know, it's when you when you came up to me and you were like that. I was like, oh man, you know, he's definitely gonna rope me into something that neither of us can handle. Oh, I can handle. Why? Besides, rope you into? I didn't rope you into anything. Okay, you you just now told me that if I continue like running with you we could just be completely targeted by one of the big three. That's... I, I, I'm pretty sure that was good information to, to, like, at least say the first night. Look, regardless, you're gonna get hunted down. Why not at least have resources and allies around that can cover your ass? I, well... You came to Blue Thorn Appraisal because you had nowhere else to go. So where do you go... After oh, you've left the place that you've had nowhere else to go. I, I don't know, but like, not gonna lie, uh, it's... Okay, which one of the big three is it? Hector. Oh! <laughs> what? Contain yourself you're, and lower your voice. You're, what? So you're... 
So you want to be stuffed full of worms and thrown into the desert, right? Like you, you, you want to have your intestines like played hopscotch with. Like that's that's what you want. I'll be the one doling out the punishments. You don't have to worry. I know what I'm getting. Before I, of course, before I pull any triggers, though, I need to make sure I have all my ammunition. That's why I have you. As I've said before, I'm... friendships are mutual. Look, I... I can help you. But I'm not going down with you. If I see that this is going south... You know, I'm I, not... I'm not asking you to come down with the ship. I'm the captain, after all. No, no. I just need you to help me get there. And then you're off. Yeah, you're lucky I you're lucky I don't have anyone anywhere else to go. Hmm? Lucky for a great many reasons. At the same time it also makes me unlucky. Besides, All right, I'd probably well, like to have somebody like me as a friend. Do we have any plan of attack then? Do you know where to strike them? Like, Information. They are huge. Information is all we need. I'm aiming to get a full roster of the entire company. All of Bluethorn. You may have not picked up some of the people here from Syracuse. Not the normal type of crowd either. Sure, there's the basic uh, uh, immigrants here, but some other people. Okay, so you... You essentially want to get everyone who works here see if you can find the link, right? You know, the inner workings. Inside and out. Every single little bit. So I can see all the cracks. Who runs security? Who manages cameras? What are the hourly shifts? <sighs> what time, uh, what, when does uh, Na get her first cup of coffee? How strong is it? Apparently very. And she drinks it every yeah, morning. How strong is it? Exceptionally. <laughs> See yeah, what I'm getting sure at, though. Fucking... Yeah, yeah, I... We know how everything Look, works. I... We know what to tweak. Without it going back to us. Or, uh... You know. Doing it secret. But I know that's... I know that's rich coming from me. I'm not exactly the best person around, but try to not burn the flowers with the weeds. Not everyone working in that company deserves whatever you got in your mind that's coming to them. So long as no one gets in my way, everyone's fine. My plight has nothing to do with them and those who don't get in my way. I uh, like. Leans back and kind of like shrugs. All right, then. I suppose it helps knowing what I'm getting into, at least. I'm going to toss a, a blanket kind of at her. Not like aggressively, just. Yeah, you know. just kind of like catches and it's like, eh, It's going to be a cold night. It doesn't have to be. <laughs> and I'm just going to like retire back to, uh, all right. Would... Yep. Oh, by the way, just before you make it, Emerald is a teenager. She's like sixteen. Just <laughs> putting that out there. I'm like, I'm, I wasn't trying to do any. Why, 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 so, um, Blizzard, you're talking to Larissa, right? Yes. Um, 
you see, like, kind of like you you both are sitting down, and she's kind of like, you know, drinking uh, some strong, like, uh, she, she's drinking her soup out of like a cup. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's like, so, do you have everything you thought it would be? Uh, yeah, overall, I'd say so far, pretty much. First mm. job wasn't wasn't expected to be this, but like you say, it's about everything. Also that... expected? <laughs> no, no, it's not. I I've got I don't know how to feel about it. I can't make an informed decision quite yet with the amount of information I have, although. Seems like it might be more trouble than it's worth. I mean, come on, it's a kid, right? Like, look, I I know if... this is this is not the correct or this is not the cautious so course of action. I get it, but like, ah, no, it doesn't really sit well with me, you know? Yeah. By that, would you mean? Do you mean getting rid of? Yes, getting rid of it doesn't sit well with me. Yeah, I, I figured. I figured. Yeah, doesn't sit well with me either. But I do still have things I have to think about, and I simply just, like I said, don't know enough about this child. I can observe and then try to make a decision later. But at the moment. <sighs> I don't really have that strong of an opinion one way or the other. Hmm. I mean, have you tried talking to it? It can't talk. Oh. Have you tried writing with it? Its answers have been exceptionally short. Very, very I mean, it's a fucking kid. I, you know, if we usually need a yeah. little more probing. Yeah, it's. If, if what they said is true, the kid could be very important. So I'm certainly not looking to do anything to upset the child or put a wedge in between us. Like I said at the moment, I, I just don't know. Hmm. Well, if the kid is very important, perhaps he could be useful. He might pay to get on his that's, good side. That's exactly what I was thinking. Glad you understand. Oh, and one more thing. I don't believe we should have an we should be out again for at least a little while for the next job. I believe it is an average week or two weeks of turnaround time in between trips. So, kind of like uh, out of his pocket, pulls out uh, pull, pulls out two tickets to uh you know I I I, I, I briefly mentioned la la last time uh, her mm -hmm. being into sports and like hockey and stuff, so he's, 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 he has, he has two tickets to a hockey game back in uh, back in Deep Root. Oh shit! Are those the Deep Root Thorns? Oh fuck yeah! I've wanted to, to watch this game for fucking weeks. Hm? Yup, big one. Last game of the year. Yeah. Either sneak into the playoffs or season's over. Yeah, go Thorns! High stakes. <laughs> High stakes. Everything to play for. Exactly. Man. What I oh, like. that's great! And who do you who do you reckon I invite uh, with this? As she like takes the second ticket, <laughs> holds it for a bit, and then just kind of like <laughs> fucking like shoulder checks you. I'll be like, ah, I'm just joshing with you. <laughs> <laughs> it was just, just like just like briefly like like he was talking and just like when she said it, just completely froze for a moment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, yeah. Ah. Yeah. Thanks, boss. Looking forward to it. Yeah, same. And you know, um, for the new job and all, I think you have what it takes. You know, for 
everything. The job and the other stuff. The other stuff is, at the end of the day, what's most important. And, well, believing is already a big chunk of the battle. After all, if you don't think you can do something. Well, as I suppose, being in Deep Root, it is sensible to bring up the words of a, a formerly great man in the auto industry. If you, whether you think you can or can't, you're right. <laughs> I forget if I forget out of character. I forget if that's a Henry Ford quote or someone else. It might be someone else, and I just hey, totally whoever, fucked that whoever, up. Whoever it is, it goes hard. <laughs> Uh, you know, this still doesn't the leave your cleaning duty. It's, it's still your turn to clean. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm well aware. And <laughs> funnily enough, when it's my turn to clean, it always ends up being eighty percent more work. You know, sometimes it just happens like that. You know, it's look. It is what it is. Big game, <laughs> kind big of like a eyebrow. <laughs> Big, big game, big snacks. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, yeah, I imagine you two just kind of, like, sit for a bit, just kind of, like, talking to each other, like, bantering, and after that, go to sleep. Yep. So, you chase uh, Kuroko. <laughs> you guys immediately just honk me near, or... Uh... <laughs> so, it's, we're at camp, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes, you're okay. okay. So I would imagine the kid the... just kind of like mostly sticks with you. Okay. What's he? What's the kid doing right now? Is he just like aimlessly walking around? Um. You see, he kind of like seems to be almost like experimenting with his surroundings. Like he he picks up a fistful of like sand and just kind of like lets it go in different fucking like speeds. He like. He, he, like, moves his hand over the fire and sees when it, like, you know, slowly enough when it's gonna get hot, you know? Mm. Seems incredibly curious about, like, everything around him. All right. Uh, I'm gonna approach the child. Uh, does it eat? Um, do you offer it food? Yeah, I'm gonna offer it my... I ate half of my portion because it's ass. So I'm just gonna oh, offer it. He just kind of, like, sticks a finger into the soup and, like, tastes it. He takes the bowl and just... <laughs> Bruh. Just drinks it all. <laughs> I'm just like, ah! Good job, good job. All right. So, I'm going to probe the kid. I'm going to pull out the paper. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you... I'm going to ask... What? Uh, hi. Uh, what do you... What do you think about this place? Oh, like, right. It's nice. Warm. Oh, wait. Has it been only communing with, with yes and no's with everyone else but me? Uh, well, it never saw any reason to, like... He never saw any reason to, like, say anything besides yes and no at the, by that point. Okay. I see. How are you getting along with everyone? I don't really know them. Are you I mean, scared? That guy called me a failure, so I imagine he doesn't like me very much. Uh, don't mind That guy... Him. That guy tries to hide it. He didn't like me very much in the beginning either. He's just writing all this down. I th this is a kid, but he has like very mature speech. Okay. Yeah, he has very like you can see incredibly like intelligent sort of like like speech vocabulary. Like I would expect like a couple of words or small sentences, but these are full blown. Okay. okay. Yeah, I don't mind them. They're a bunch of angry adults, old old dusty old men. They're all. Yeah, I think they're pretty gross. Hmm. Why but, did you try to set yourself apart from them? Well, because I try not to be grow close to others. After what happened to me uh, not too long ago, which is why I'm working in this shithole. 
So excuse my French, or what's what's French in the Arknights universe? You see, he just writes bad word. <laughs> <laughs> what's French in this bad in this whatever? It's, uh, it's, it's Gaulish. Gaulish. My Gaulish. Gaulish. <laughs> Gaulish. Excuse my Gaulish. Excuse my Gaulish. <laughs> but yeah, this place is a dump, and uh, as as I, as I rub my arm, I have I'm kind of stuck here. And I'm going to tell him, do you understand your own strength? Do you understand what you could do? What do you mean? What you did back there when you, at the, at the old, at the building. Uh, do you understand what you did? I didn't do anything. Hmm. Okay. You didn't do anything. I'm gonna step back a little bit because that's kind of scary, but I'm gonna approach him again. I see. Well, just know that I'll if if you if anything troubles you, just come to me. And we'll, we can have a little chat, you know. As I I'll give him a little rub on the head. He nods. And, Very well. Uh, does it feel and exhausted? It's... Does it feel exhaustion? Huh? What does do Neo you... feel tired? I mean, it's night. I would imagine you do feel somewhat tired. Well, he's not really exactly human. I don't understand. I, I don't know if he feels like exhaustion. Or he anything. was, but he was born at age nine out of goo. You know, he has a little. <laughs> He's built a little different. He's a literal homunculus. Mm, yes, I would say I, I am... Does mm. he even understand the concept of tired or sleep? You don't know. He just seems like... I seem to be okay. slowing down, yes. Okay. Well, I'm gonna... Since I, I see no signs of him... Or I'm gonna let him do whatever he wants. I'm gonna tell him to not cause any trouble. I'm feeling oh, a bit dogs. exhausted. It's been a it's been a long day for me for my frail old bones. He just kind of like gonna... points at the at the notebook. Can I keep this? Oh, of course, of course. Uh, since Kuroko had a history of drawing, she draws him a little a little picture of him, a little sketch. It's, she hasn't drawn in a while, so it looks ass. <laughs> Fair enough, like, just to kind of like indicate that this is his not cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's like, well, I'm gonna call it for a little bit, so good night. If you have anything, just come, come to the car and nudge me awake. I'll listen. And nice. I walk off. And he also does the same. Like, no, Chaser! Me. No, he walks off. Okay. <laughs> he, he goes to explore the camp a bit more. Chaser! Okay, so... Do we have, like, a, a room or, like, a private space for, like, uh, each one of us? Or do I have to go back no, to the you, apartment? <laughs> you, you guys are, are sleeping in, like, tents. So you... Okay, is that, like, a... A tent far off to the side where I can be on my own. You can set your tent wherever you want. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna set my tent a bit far off so I can be uh, by myself. So we could have okay. some. Then uh, I I take out the seaborn in there, like when it's just the two of us. I take it out from uh, the wooden box, and mm -hmm. uh, I'm I start interrogating it at this point. After today, I start interrogating it. I'm like. Uh, Okay, why are we here? You know, you better have a damn good reason for us to be here after what happened today. It just, like, communicates structure, power. So, all, all of this is just uh, to find some structure and give yourself power. That That's all. You different? 
Well, it's not like I want power, per se. I just don't really have anything else to do with my life, you know? I shipwrecked, I found you on a beach. Power. What? Won't be free until power. I guess that's true. Uh, yeah, I guess we are on the same page, after all. Is that why you wanted to eat that guy's eye? Oh, it nods. Huh. I imagine it's the the same prof process as the uh, the staff, right? That's when you grew. That that would have done the same, right? Me, defective. Me need to find power elsewhere. Huh. Why are you defective, actually? You never really went into detail about that. This is a time as good as any, I think. Don't need to do what my brethren do. Can think. Can't act very well. So, what? Are you out of the hive mind or something like that? You could say. That's interesting. So, so not even all their seaborns are gonna be on uh, our side, I gather. If they realize. And we really are on the same page. I'm starting to see why you made a pact instead of just, uh, you know, killing me after I was just a. Uh, Shipwrecked and basically dead. Told you, I smart. I know. I guess you are pretty smart. You know, on the ships, people kept saying uh, seaborns were like uh, stupid and just following a hive mind. But uh, you seem pretty independent. Yes. Not sure, gift or curse. It's probably a gift. I mean, you wouldn't be having such incredible adventures with us otherwise. Almost died today. That's, uh, I think that's a part of life, you know? Uh, maybe it's just because of how I grew up, but uh, honestly, I'm pretty used to it, you know, ending the day and being like, uh, yeah, I almost died today. I think it's part of the, uh, well, not human experience. I guess it's just the experience. Hmm. Understood. Our pretty smart. could be worse. Yeah, we could have died. Hmm. If man, it's a man. shame that guy died, isn't it? Why? Well, he could have been a really powerful ally. You know? Or As uh, Sebas was saying, that would be the winning side, quote-unquote. No. No powerful allies. Only us powerful. Yeah, I get what you mean, but, like, they're, they're gonna be a stepping stone. You gotta think long term. That's a, that's a thing I thought as a, as a pirate in Iberia. You make powerful allies, and then you backstab them at the first opportunity. So, we backstab these people too? If we get the chance, yes. Hmm. We get a lot stronger together. Yeah, we do. You know, I never really stopped to talk to you like this. You're more reasonable than I thought. Think better now. Eating that thing. But it uh, improved your uh, smartness, too? Yes. 
that's interesting. Do you think you're gonna, like, learn to talk or something if you keep evolving? Heard. One that talked. Maybe... I can, too. Did hear myths about some seaborns that apparently can talk, but I, I never really believed them. I guess... <laughs> I guess you disprove that, though. I it's should have believed them. Born. Pretty unusually Gyrian. We'll what? figure it out. He said pretty unusual Seaborn, pretty unusually Gyrian. We're gonna figure it oh, out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I just gotta get that kid on my good side, too. So, uh... Probably it wasn't a good idea to call it a failure. Maybe I can uh, spin it in uh, some way. Child powerful. I don't know if it's actually Dracula powerful is. or it just uh, reflected the power of uh, that guy. Either way, it's gonna be a good uh, stepping stone, as I said before. We either ally or assimilate. I guess you could assimilate him if you want, given the chance. I'm not gonna stop you. Good. Try not to piss it off. No. I didn't think it was gonna just erase the guy, you know? Okay. And, uh... At least you were, like, tired now. Yeah. Go back, go to sleep, it's, uh, it's quite late. Yeah, I should go to sleep, so, actually. Kind like, nods, goes back to its box. And I with that... Lay down. This is a Etristian? Interesting party, you mean? <laughs> anyway, you guys all go to sleep. Holy shit, every single one of you is, is horrible. <laughs> is what? Is what? What? <laughs> horrible. Oh, yeah, horrible we're all horrible. <laughs> we're all horrible. I'm not a bad person. I'm the most, no, I'm the most no, genuine no, person. Okay, no, to I'm the most genuine person. To be fair, Kuroko is like uh, actually a good person. <laughs> is I know like what you guys are talking I'm about. Asshole. I'm an asshole, Kuroko. but I'm not. But I'm, but I'm, but I'm, I'm not a good bad person. person, I suppose. Yeah. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I did nothing wrong. All I did was offer to support my friend. You tried to. You tried to ally with the enemy. Because you wanted to live. Would you I fucking? Would, oh my that. god! Let that go, asshole. <laughs> I've never. Like, it was so five hours ago. Also, it was. It was, it was I literally. Hold I hold grudges. I hold grudges. Froggy, I don't. You know what? It doesn't matter. It's not gonna get through Kuroko's okay. fucking thick skull of like I said that shit to lie, to fucking you live. Rolled, you did. You didn't roll deception. You rolled persuasion. Uh, it, it, uh, that one honestly could have been a, a toss-up to either. I mean, and you also, guys did kind of talk amongst each other when he wasn't is, listening to it you. Is you did still say it is you would literally the same fucking check. You have to adapt. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, okay. You okay. have to be flexible. I don't think I've done anything particularly Or you die. I mean, I felt drugs, but like... The, also, only, uh, the only thing I've done is be now, an asshole. Before I, now, I thought that Jason was the most morally, like, about. upstanding guy. Now I'm just like, oh, he's probably just fucking betray all of you and just fucking, like, the fuck you got mine, the entire fucking crew. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's like the whole thing. He's like all Ooh. innocent and nice, but obviously it's fucking fake. <laughs> But I have Don't a laugh course exterior exactly. with a nice heart. I don't know, oh, I'd say, I'd say like my goals are all noble. To you, yeah, that's your character. Yeah, or mine. I, I am doing right. the world a service. Me, me all right, so like, we we're doing, we're doing, do we wake up so the next good. day? You guys wake up the next. No, you're all assassinated in your sleep. Yes, you wake up the next day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we the, the, the child kills like us all. Ebola. The child kills us all. No, we woke up dead. 
and uh, you guys realize that there's gonna be, uh, if everything goes the same way as it did, you will meet the adjudicator uh, thing again. You don't know what the fuck how they're gonna react to the kick. <laughs> oh, I actually mm. I remembered, and I foresaw this happening. You know why? I was uh, this is what I'm telling the group. Uh, so I figured before we hit this uh, checkpoint again, this time we properly hide precious cargo. If you know what I'm saying. Wow. Kind of gesture You're over in a box. I was actually, I was box. gesturing over to Emerald, but, uh, yeah, I, I uh, no clue what the adjudicators are going to say about this one. Gorak, would, would, would we have to, like, perceive the, the carts to see where we could fucking stash her? Well, I mean, I could just, like, go to the roof. They don't seem to really be looking okay, that Okay, hold on, hold on. Kuroko's like, okay, so they're, they're gonna, they're gonna, gonna like... Lie flat on the roof! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They'll take a seaborn, but they can't take some... Uh, child that possesses unknown power. Come on now. They didn't know it was. A they scary. didn't know it was a seaborn. They he never said Bruh. it was a seaborn. Box was scary. No. Bruh. Box make noise. Box scary. That's why they left. Yeah, bro. Yeah, like shot like a when the box box started shaking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you spooked him well. So yeah, uh, all right. I guess uh, we could do the roof or any other compartments or whatnot. Um, just so we have a game plan, right? And we know yeah. where to put our stuff. Emerald. Emerald is kind of willing to do anything. She can go on the roof. She can go underneath the car. She, you can hide her pretty well and pretty efficiently. It's just that the kid, you know. All right. So yeah, yeah. Didn't Emerald uh, um... hide underneath? One of the seats last time. Yeah, she did, but she almost got found. Can yeah. she hide under the cart? Literally yeah, under yeah, she said, the cart. She cart. said that, that that's one of the the options. She said she can go under the cart if she needs to. Yeah, literally like hang on the the bottom of the cart. Yep. So so we have more space to to hide the kid. Now, that's what I'm saying. Uh, like Emerald can go in all these places, like the roof underneath. Yeah, all of these, I, like... I say we prioritize the kid hiding the kid, and then we, Emerald we've all just been goes on the same fucking page. whatever. Yeah, we're all on the same page. Ah, uh, let's see, let's see. Um, I don't know. Is big? Is kids only one meter tall? Right. So. Yep. Ah. Uh, can't put them in a bag. Is there any... Uh, would there be theoretically any possibility of when we're about to get checked, take sword out of box, if you hide that somewhere, you can hide that just about anywhere, and then have kid hide in box briefly? Yeah, we'll just do that. And uh, cool. let's make we'll, sure we'll you... convince the kid. Mm -hmm. Well, Kuroko, clearly. Kuroko? All right, fine. <laughs> okay, fucking kid. Where, is this, where is this little buddy? Okay, uh, Neo, Neo. I beckon over to him. Uh, yeah, he's here. He's, he's, he's here, yeah. Yeah, I will. I'm, I'm just waving my hand at him. Uh, I need you, uh, if you're comfortable with it, of course, to... Wait, we're stuffing him under a couch or something? What are we doing? In a box. Oh, in a box. Of course, it's a fucking box. Okay, uh, this might get a little rough, but here, I removed my... I was my... talking more before before we are at the back. They stop and check the front first. I would... I would say the more when box? we get stopped. I don't, I don't know if we should have the kid in the box the whole time. Well, does the box have air holes? I am concerned. Yes. I am concerned, yeah. Mom. Super, okay. super subscribe repeatedly, it has holes. Yeah, there is okay. four uh, air holes. F four separate ones, yes. Okay, um... Neo. I need you. I take off my coat and uh, my car, uh, my purple coat, and I place it in the box. Uh, <coughs> I need you to... And this is the first time I'm seen without with my scruffy-ass hair, just like all the way down. I need you to lay in this box for a little bit while we enter a pretty 
scary place, so try not to make any noise, please. And I'll let you out soon. Yep. And I get Persuasion. One on the head. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Persuasion. Persuasion. I swear to God. Uh, I'm so good. Ooh. I'm a top tip, top kek mom. Thinks for a bit. Considers it. Nods. Mm -hmm. Right. Well. There we go. Kid in the box. Just like that one cold case. No, right. Oh nice. fuck, what did you remind me of? The fucking kid in a box. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, my god. <laughs> you got it, you got it. Oh my fucking god. Actual PTSD from there. <laughs> okay. Okay. And you're in a skibbity boots. Have you're in a skibbity toilet. Um, Watch that. <laughs> I've hidden both of them. Where did you hide your seaboard, by the way, if it's not in the box? Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Where do we put it? Exactly. Seaboard? What the? Why uh, would you? No, 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 can no, I like hide it, like it in my shirt? Like, can he, he like he... wrap around my body? I think Blizzard brought so it up earlier. Just turn, around my body. just turn it into a sword. It looks like a sword. A weird sword, but it looks it like looks a sword. It looks like a weird sword, yes. <laughs> it looks like a fleshy, weird sword. They're not gonna ask questions about that? Do you want me to Art You could say it's, art you could it say it's, it's an artisanal uh... piece. You could say it's family heirloom. Yeah. It could uh... also go over or under the card. It has all these tentacles. It can, like, you know, wrap around the rims or something. and like. It can keep the Emerald uh, company. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, it can okay. keep Emerald Company. Whichever side of the cart this thing is going, I'm going to the other one. <laughs> End time. Oh, don't like our little friend? <laughs> uh, it's a seaborn! Yeah, but it oh, won't, it's like, friendly. eat you, I think. It won't eat her, right? No, it yeah, won't. It We're all friends here. Yeah, so you, you're promising me that it won't, like, eat her. Right. No, no, it won't hit her. It probably can't, honestly. Okay, but I need you to say, I, I promise. I promise you, Miss, M Mr. Sebas. Okay. You heard him. He promises. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> besides, if, <laughs> if the, uh, if the Seaborn is next to you, we might be able to help you faster. It is a weapon. All right, all right. You made your point. Ooh. I'm not sure how strong it is, but if it's strong enough, you may even be able to get a brief respite from grasping the underside of the carriage if it can. Uh, I'm, I'm like strong as fuck. No worries. <laughs> okay. All right. So then we we enact our plan. We get the box ready. We do all the stuff, and then I'm like, all right, we're good to go. Strong is one thing, but you are human, right? Well, technically, I'm a waver. Also, yes, they could so they are. could uh, use you know ropes to like tie themselves down if they want. Mm -hmm. All right, so you guys are back on the road, and um, you know, with both of them under the cart and with um, the kid in the box, I'm not even gonna like make this a whole scene. You guys get through. Like, there's no reason they would, uh, you know. They would go harder than last time in the investigation. <laughs> exactly. We're them. Yeah. All right, you can let the so, little kid out of the box. And, all right, I'm assuming we get there and we know. Yep, yeah. now you get to Deep Root. Back to the City of Dreams. <laughs> wham, yeah. Wham, wham, go to the docks, the caravan stops, wham. and you guys are let out. You can see Bluethorn appraisals often in the distance, and um, it's time to get paid, boys. Mm -hmm. Time to get paid. Now, how are you gonna, uh, like, tell him about the kid? <laughs> okay. Uh... Listen to me. Listen to me. Hold up. Yeah, it's, a, it's just some orphan we found on the fucking actually, street. <laughs> no, actually, yes. So. We say it's not it that is, hard to explain a child. He's just Sorry. just some random, uh, you know, straggler kid. Somebody probably left him in the desert. 
We picked him up. We prob- He doesn't really talk, but we assume that he wandered into the structure on his own, and we just never noticed. I, I think perhaps it may even, may even be better to just say found the kid left in the desert, even more than the structure. I feel like if we Larissa, mention the structure, they're going to want to... Right, well, Larissa's anyway. not going to corroborate that. We didn't just find him in the desert. We ran out there with him. That is true, but... <laughs> so, like, 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 Blizzard kind of holds up, you know, phone, communicator. I could probably get her to. All right, fine. Okay, so you call Arisa? Yep. Yeah, you know, Blizzard, I could go along with it, but I can't exactly force my people to go along with it, right? Like, okay. they also have a contract with Luthorn, so, like, yeah, I don't know. You know, it might be better just not risk it. Okay. How many of them, curiously, would there be an opinion asked of, and how trustworthy would they be considered? If it's your well, word imagine versus it would their all be word. Debriefed and, uh... I mean, you guys are C Squad, right? I'm pretty sure they would at least investigate if they said anything you didn't. You know, you're not exactly trusted yet. Fair enough. It's every every single every single one of them being taken in individually. That's impressive. Well, no, we're all going to be together. Ah, that makes a bit more sense. All right. Well, I mean, I could also convince her on the phone and give her a plausible story that'll work and even a way to potentially cover our asses. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, so Blizzard, Blizzard is going to like kind of or for a moment, uh, kind of like, you know, hold, do the thing where you kind of take the phone away from your ear, kind of put your hand over you know, the right. receiver and everything and just ask, all right, any other ideas? But just like the, the, the like the kind of kind of like taking it away from your ear and like putting your hand over where like the the microphone and everything where okay, it picks up the okay. sound just asking the group again yeah. all right any other ideas well uh saying that we found him in the desert is the easiest way to do this and my idea is what do we let larissa know uh to uh let the guys know it's just more paperwork if they do it otherwise or any other way um, and that, uh, you know, somebody is going to provide him with a, a you know, a, a nice dinner. Rob him a little bit, butter him up. Should cover our butter asses. Up. Not, Especially if they don't want to deal with more mention, work. Like, they don't want to deal with more work, not to mention, I'm sure she has credible information on if any of them are doing things a little below board. And, I wouldn't ask if she didn't have and pool. He, yeah, and 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 he he is going to kind of you know, have a kind of you know sorry. put the phone back put the phone back into the ear. It could work, but I can't guarantee it. At the end of the day, if I say your story and my people don't, I'm also gonna get in deep water. I would prefer if I just said the truth. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, no, I still think you should lie. You know what? All right. I can lie. I, I can't guarantee you that all of us are going to lie, okay? In that way, you are going to get caught No, no. No, it's... It's fine. I don't want... I won't force you to do Wait, this. I have another idea. You guys are all from Deep Root, right? True. You guys are all from Deep Root? Define from. Just, you've lived around here, yeah? Yeah, I guess. Lived here for nearly a decade. Okay. Perfect. Listen. Do you have any people that maybe we could just leave the kid with? Alaris and the rest that we just dropped him off at some orphanage or something. Perhaps. There is a group, and... Given he can dematerialize, what if he learned to materialize? He could... This could work. He could be incredibly useful. 
Mm. And of course, be treated like a normal child, which probably he needs. Okay, I well, be, all right. I'm, I'm already his surrogate mother. You know. How you guys want me to uh, to to take him over so you guys don't have him when you get your give your debriefing? Larissa asks. Yes. How's yeah. About, uh, Leave him. No, hold on. Uh, Leave him about... with the theater. I was gonna suggest, uh, Lizard. Why don't you go with her? And uh, we're gonna get lunch before we debrief. Well, they get a little bit pissed at us. That's fine. It was an extra long ride. Mm. Ah. They ain't saying talk a little more there. Okay. I guess we, uh... It's about time, then. We should go. Um... It does feel Lisa? like if we proceed through... If we proceed with that, though, it does feel like they are going to start asking questions. Once again, it being an extra long ride is difficult to get cooperated. Okay, so you guys are gonna take him over to the I theater. Think it might. Yeah, I think I think it might be good for now. Okay, so they'll leave you him guys somewhere do. out of sight. That's that somewhere that is, believe me, out of sight and out of mind. Uh, Lead yeah, me and we will oh, go to Mickey D's. Quick, uh, quick. What time uh, of day is it right now? It's a. It's morning going into noon. Okay. Um, are there uh, are there any cafes between like around the area? Nice cafes? Yeah, yeah, there are a few. Yeah, okay, yeah, cool. Yeah. We'll go to a nice cafe and uh, from whatever the fuck so, they're going to eat or something. Oh, sorry. Lisa and Larissa are going to leave to go to the theater and, and drop the kid there, and you guys are going to go to the cafe. Yeah. Cool. Uh, Blizzard, and La Blizzard, I will need you to roll me a perception. Oh, no! Oh, maybe not, no! Wow, maybe that's yes. pretty good. Decent. It's... Uh, Oh way! This is so sad. Is, is 18 not enough? Let me roll her to... fucking. Let me roll her perception real fucking quick. So just, that fucking just, rat. Just kinda like, you know, that fucking yeah, rat. Just kinda... <laughs> Wait, what are you? What are you referring to? I already know. I'm not gonna say it, but I already fucking know. Oh, 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 oh fucking rat. Oh, 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 oh. So you and Larissa go take the kid, and as you're like walking out of the like uh, you know the hangar, you just feel an arm kind of like wrap around your shoulder in a friendly fucking hug, and it's like, hey, Blizzard buddy, bro, who would have known? C Squad returned at, at the same time as the A Squad. What? And you see Slasher beside you, just kind of fucking Ugh. with the yeah. That's shit the fucking the rat. Head. That's the little rat. I fucking know. Uh... Yep. Yep. Who would have thought, indeed? <laughs> well, uh, what's up, A Squad? Hope your mission hey, went well. How's we were, it going? we were just about to God go get fuck. lunch. Why don't you, uh, why don't you join us? No. Yes. You see, like, you see, like, um, fucking like, um, Slasher, like, rushed up first to like catch up with you guys. Um, but you do see, like, Marsh kind of following her with, like, bloodied, like, bandages around her arms looking, like, very, like, she's been in a fight. And Joker looks absolutely fucking pristine. Like, man's peacock feathers are, like, fully fucking cleared, fully. And Marsh is like, yeah, it was a little harder than expected. Fucking gullish larper motherfuckers. <laughs> so he's like, eh, you know, could be better, could be worse. <laughs> Joker, buddy, how's it going? Good to see you, pristine hey. as always. You know it. Uh, how's the editing going, by the way? How's the what going? The editing, you know, for, for my book. Oh, yeah, actually, I, I got a couple pages done. Uh, I'll be sure to send you a draft Ooh. later. Nice. Hey. All right, while while all of you are, are doing that, I I do have to I do have to briefly take a stop off at the at the theater. Uh, one, of, right. one, one of the kids right. who they're raising so, uh, is... Who's the kid? I got one of the kids who they're raising here. It's one of the kids being raised by the theater. They, oh, that, it's one that's of. That's weird. Did you, did yeah, you take the kid that they were raising with you on the run? No, so you get out of no, the <laughs> no. Just gonna really. <laughs> it's a, it's a long story. It's a really long story. Well, you but... know, I think it's a story that we can all recap back at the office. <laughs> they want us yeah. to be brief now, you know. So you know, we should be going. 
Uh uh, lunch first. Come on, and join I us. I need to get uh, this child back. Company policy, debrief first. Mm -hmm. All at least see as an on the way back, I'm allowed to at least pick up something. Oh, you can pick up like a like a sandwich or something. Yeah, sure, but like yeah, I'll, do, I'll just do that. Can't, can't be too tardy. Ah, hmm? uh, don't laugh me. That's and... a very funny question. <laughs> like the, 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 the Blizzard is still saying like you know like decent person policy. You know, it's like the company policy. I do need to take the kid back to, you know, their family in their proper place. Right, right. And their family was just riding around in the middle of the desert. Uh, hey. Blizzard, buddy. Blizzard, why don't you just have Larissa go take it? Yeah, that is true. Okay. You know what, guys? You're my friend. So I'm just gonna be forthright with this. The kid's going to Bluethorn. A kid? What would Bluethorn want with some kid that we just found in the desert? You see, like, as you say that, Marsh just kind of, like, exhales very loudly from her, like, nostrils in a way that's like, hey, no more fucking talk, you know? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I mean I'm, I'm standing there. I do have a smug look on my face. I'm, I'm a little bit smug right now. Yeah. So, situation here is Slasher and Marsh want the kid back. The only person here who could potentially stop them, because they can just take the kid back if they wanna, yeah. is Joker, who is currently too distracted by a nearby mirror. <laughs> Ugh. He's so epic. Hey, Joker, <laughs> buddy. Um. Remember one of those favors that you said you'd offer me for editing your books? Your trilogy, your saga. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, what's up? Look, we have some work to do here. We gotta take drop off the brat at some orphanage or theater or something. Oh, the, the kid from, from the cart, right? Like, he's... I mean, you guys probably found him in the, in the structure, right? Like, no, I no, saw him get out of the cart. Yeah, we, we saw him, like, towards the entrance or something. I think it was just some kid that was dropped off and wandered. Truth be told, really, for outside the city, crazy, right? But I know for a yeah, fact, yeah, that's wow. Part of, part of <laughs> your insane. memoirs, part of your memoirs, you've seen crazier, and I know that for a fact, buddy. You know, you are, you, you have mind, what I mean, and you see, like Mars, you seem the biggest fucking stink guy, uh. <laughs> and uh, you know, he likes you, but is he going to like? fully be like, yeah, when his team is very clearly giving him hints that no. <laughs> so, <laughs> persuasion. <laughs> Can I roll with advantage if I offer something to him? And I know. Well, his own squad seems to be against the idea, so I will say the advantage gets cancelled out. Fine. Persuasion? Yes, persuasion. <laughs> Ooh, pretty good, pretty good. It's like... Ah, you know what? Weirder things, right? What what do we want with a brat anyway? Like, like I'm pretty sure Jezebel wouldn't even like, you know, she would be like mad. We you know, we wasted her time. You know how the boss is on her time being wasted. <laughs> oh, you get it better than anyone else, bro. Yeah, you know me, always keeping it real. <laughs> so you, you see certainly like certainly do have excellent perception. <laughs> Yeah, that guy is fucking like, he's very good at fighting. He's apparently a very good inventor. He's not very perceptive or insightful. I'm gonna, <laughs> I, I will turn my gaze to Slasher and just say, uh, trust me. I'll, I'll actually have a very straight, almost grimace, like v real seriousness on my face. I just be like, trust me, there are more important things we need to talk about other than some brat we found. Not just the company. You guys are probably also going to need to hear this. Ah, that's going to be a bad deception. <laughs> that's the, I'm telling the truth, though. Is 
Is that certainly no, the there's same? There's nothing more untrue. important than the kid at this particular moment. The kid is literally the crux of everything. <laughs> does he even think that? Does Sebus even think that himself, that the kid is that important? Like, if, if, if he doesn't even think that himself, then it wouldn't be like he'd be lying. I don't think that myself. Like, 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 yeah, like, like, we may know out of character that the kid is important, but in character, we don't really know much about this fucking kid. Well, I see the kid as potentially maybe a piece or just some off product. That's my viewpoint of it. Not as... I mean, look, it will have to be their persuasion or deception, but this is very much something you're, like, you know... This is very much you're trying to, to like, wordsmith her right now. It's not like... 21. Hmm. Let me roll for her. Rolling. That's insight. If if, if, if Skorak gets this, we, we, we all claim that he rigged it, right? It's bullshit, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it, it's rigged. Why? It's she has a plus 10 wins, on inside. <laughs> she has a plus 10 on inside. How the fuck would it have been rigging it? That rigged. is utter bullshit. Actually, yeah. She's yeah. a fucking yeah. plus 10. That's yeah, fucking bullshit, man. You rigged it, yeah. Bro, bullshit. she you're is rigged. literally a fucking, like... She's a, she's a fucking, like, gremlin of, like, in, like the highest quality. <laughs> Oh, wait, wrong fucking also, command. Um, am I crazy or, or have the rules not updated on stream again? Uh, check. Okay, yeah. Um, okay, okay, no, it's, 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 so, it's fine. I'm crazy. Uh, Slasher kind of looks at you for a moment, just very dead serious. And then being like, ah, you know, <laughs> you have a point there. Uh, you know. If that's the case, we should all go, right, guys? Right, guys? Hey, crocodile lady, take him there. We're gonna all go for the briefing, right? And she's gonna just walk beside you. And as she walks beside you, you just hear, We're gonna talk about that kid later. So, Only if we do it in private. she succeeded on the inside, but she's letting it slide for now because this is interesting. <laughs> I'm gonna lean you know, down. Sure I'm, I'm just gonna show the roll. He's I am gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna lean yeah, she down. Yeah, on that one. I'm sure that one. Uh, and just be like, we're still going by that fancy cafe on our way back, though. Eat your fucking sandwich, and we're going to Blue Phone. Do you want anything? Uh, you know, give me a burrito. Got it. Well, I'm gonna go that right. uh, there. No, uh, also, uh, uh, just just of note, um, I'm gonna get by the strongest coffee they have, and I even tell them make it Ooh. like a quadruple shot, like espresso. Okay, Basically, okay. nothing but like just espresso, but a whole cup <laughs> of their strongest. Taylor, shit. what coffee do you want? What no? <laughs> what no orders? Holy shit! <laughs> nah, coffee. Yeah. I figured Nah, nah got nah. Uh, got her shit from from Bluethorn. Didn't know she went to a shop. I mean, Bluethorn don't doesn't brew their own coffee. <laughs> yeah, they do. There's a cafeteria. Of course they do. We've had their coffee there. <laughs> don't lie to me. Uh, I'll order a gnaw coffee. Yeah, this is gonna be like the most important <laughs> lore detail that's a yeah, uh, uh, coffee, um, coffee. Um, uh, a cappuccino, and uh, uh you know, a, a couple of very, very fancy, nice croissants. Oh, and the burrito. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. cool. This, this does mean something. This isn't a sidetrack thing, I swear to god. Okay. Yeah. Uh, cool, cool. I, I, I hand slash her, uh, her fucking burrito. Nice. All right, and we walk into the Blue Thorn appraisals. Okay, you guys walk in, and um, uh, all right, you, you you see like noise like, holy shit, you're alive. Well, I'll be. All right, well, debrief time, I suppose. And you know what? Since the squad is here, might as well, you know, brief them as well. No, no reason to like not do that. I'm just gonna hand her the coffee. Ah, oh, thanks. Kind of like takes a sip. 
Eh, bit light for my taste, but hey, you know, it's their own. Uh, it's that fancy shop. Apparently, apparently, this is what you get when you ask for the gnaw order, so you'll have to reprimand them later. <laughs> ah, fuck. <laughs> you know, I always told him he, he got, he's got to put more caffeine in it. Hmm? All right, so you guys um, enter like the debrief room, and we are gonna switch scenes again. And yeah, you know, A Squad just kind of like sits down, seem like very used to this. Like, you know, Joker puts his fucking feet on the table. Slasher just kind of like, you know, polishing her cleavers. And uh, you guys, this is your first debrief. So, so you know, it's kind of like. Uh, all right, everyone, what have you found? Hey, squad, why don't you guys go first? You see the guy looks like he's like... All right, boss, so get this, right? There are people activating the sea structures on purpose, right? Like, that's crazy. So, <laughs> um, you know, we found some guys, I guess the Corsica's return or something, some... Gaulish LARPers, you know, like, ooh, big fucking empire, whatever. Uh, so they were there, took care of them, uh, got to the center of the structure. Apparently there was this guy called the Seeker who also wanted it. It was like a big fucking thing, right? Like the, the guys wanted it and he wanted it. And like they fought and we fought them. And it was like a big three-way fight. It was, oh, it was amazing. He's still alive, but he got out, like he got away. Um, So we kind of like went around uh, and we activated the structure you activated a structure i mean yeah aren't we not supposed to do that look if there's like a big fucking war of like different factions that all of them want to like take control of them why don't we do it we can take control of them. Whatever the fuck they do, it's fucking big and everyone wants things, so... Hmm. All we have to do is win. And we... Well, <laughs> we keep winning. Hmm. This isn't my call. No, he's like, well, I suppose typical A-Squad stuff, although... If people want to activate the sea structures, that's definitely gonna hurt our bottom line. That's... You know, we can't have our scavengers having to contend with fucking zealous national fanatics or something every time they have to go and get shit. I'll have to talk to Miss Jezebel about what we want to do about this whole, I guess, activation war or whatever that's going on. Um, okay, C-Squad, what, what about you? Well, speaking of activations, uh, more Gaulish LARPers. Activating the AC structure we were at. And, uh... They seem to have a lot of people there. Or at least a lot of something there. Uh, we ended up going to that center room. The one you told oh, us about. Fuck. And, was uh, he there? Yeah, he was. It's Shit. actually astonishing we even got out of there. But, uh, first, let me tell you. Uh, took your advice, played into his uh, narcissism, kept us alive. Hey, you know, listen to me, you'll get far. Next thing he did was go to his panel, start activating it, and I think he was trying to create, get even more power. Maybe even recreate a uh, previous admin or something. Actually, can you remind me what was it exactly he was trying to do? Uh, yeah, he, he essentially wanted to, like, recreate the original administrator to take his power. Got it. So, yeah, I'm going to say that, you're right, he uh, was trying to create the original administrator so he could take power, but then right before it was about to go off, something broke, and he just... You know what happened to your friends? Uh-huh. Or your team? That to him. From the structure? Something in the process, yeah. It was also a lot of light. We couldn't exactly see what was going on. 
I mean... I was crazy, though. From what I... From what our scouts are telling us, the structure seems to be active right now. Like, we had no way of, uh... Of deactivating it. So after he left, some... I guess of his men or something, right? Came rushing in. And then, as we were running out, that's when we saw this scythe come back and, and take out two of the rank and file. And uh, from what I saw, it was Agent Caron from Eden Logistics was on the badge. What I just said. fucking goes pale, like. Yeah. Eden is in on this? Eden's in on this. Fuck, we. You know what? Best course of action, we we contact them first, right? If we uh, if we come clean, if we say that we were there, like oh, you know, scavenging, we didn't do anything. Maybe they won't send a consultant over. Hmm? Shouldn't we consult Miss Bluethorn about this? I, you know, it's yes, yes, we will. I just, you know, I'm just speedballing the the most realistic plan, you know. I, you know, of course, it's it's down to her, uh, but who, <laughs> who? Well, what's the best that we can do to not get them involved, aside from being semi-transparent? Obviously, I don't we know, probably want to embellish a few not, things. Convince them we're not big enough of a factor in all of this, I guess. Well, which is difficult to do when one of the sea structures has. Which one of you was it? And you see, like, uh, Mars kind of like raise her hand. Has Marsh of Bluethorn appraisals registered as the fucking admin? Okay. Uh, so. We were spotted by Eden at one sea structure. You know, as we were leaving, as it was still active. And another C structure has one of our employees as its admin. Okay, so this looks really bad. Uh yeah. Right. Another thing we can do is I don't know. I mean, try to convince them that our involvement is beneficial, you know? If the war is gonna happen, right? If people are gonna try to activate the C structures, we can say we're on their side, you know? Be like, hey, we're gonna activate the sea structures, we're gonna win, and once we do that, we're gonna do whatever the fuck you guys tell us with. Tell us to do with the structure. You're that, just incentivizing if, them to have an agent from Eden work here. And have an I, omnipresent yeah, yeah. eye. I mean, Listen look, to your own words, Nah. You know how business works, or at least you should by this point. Let me talk to them. I was first contact, right? Worst case, all of you guys could just pin the blame on me. Shed yourselves, right? Why don't I do the talking? You I want cons- to talk to Eden Logistics? First-hand experience. And of course, I should be consulting with Miss Bluethorn herself during the meeting. Yes, I, I'll, I'll need to talk to Miss Bluethorn. How about that? All right, all right, so, uh, imminent destruction of our company aside, uh, what what else? That's about it. We ran out. Oh, right, we were running out, and as we were running out, uh, we spotted a kid by the entrance. Just seemed like some desert rat. Something that somebody left there, the dropped entrance. off. Oh, I mean, if there was a kid around, like, the middle of nowhere when a sea structure activated, that's gotta be somewhat important. Where, where's the kid? Oh, we dropped him off at some orphanage or something. But, uh... Oh, be real, cool. the kid we're, gonna, was... we're gonna send some... We're gonna send some agents to get them over. What's, uh... What's the orphanage's name? Uh, I can't remember at this moment, but, uh... Make sure to get back to you right you know uh, immediately. Yeah, that's fine. We're gonna... We're gonna, you know, come around and ask a few questions. We're gonna get him. For sure. Okay, well, um... Oh, you know what? Actually, there's three more people here. I was only talking to you. Do you guys remember what the name of the orphanage was? Hmm? Guys? 
Uh, no. I wait. Kuroko's brain just broken. Yeah, I, the other two are just but, not talking, and Kuroko's brain is broken. <laughs> bruh, hold up. Uh, Can I bullshit like it just uh, an orphanage name that like I saw on the way here? <laughs> You definitely can. They're gonna figure like, I'm out the gonna say, oh, yeah, it's there. I'm gonna say, look, I haven't been here for long. I've been here like two days, and one of them I was at the structure. So uh, I believe it was this one. You know what? Why don't you guys go get him? Right? We're gonna we're gonna reconvene here tomorrow. You guys bring the kid. It's gonna be fine. It's better than just going around searching fucking deeper like maniacs. You know. On it, boss. Got it. Um. So, uh, I imagine that's all then. Activation structures. People want to activate the structures payment. and. Uh, oh, payment. Of course. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So for this particular job, uh, each one of you gets two hundred one D, and uh, two hundred. Is that, oh, that, that's, that's enough to buy a pack of crackers. <laughs> that's is it. that equivalent to gold? Uh, yes, essential. Okay. No, actually, that's equivalent to silver. So it's uh, it's about twenty gold. Hmm? I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> Two hundred for that. We, 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 we can actually just buy ourselves like each one fucking bag of goddamn goldfish crackers. That's yeah, all the money we got. We should buy a, a, a bag of snacks and that's it. No, it's not, it's not that low. That's like 20 days wage for like an, like an average artist, right? I actually did the, uh, the math on how much LMD is to like real world money and um, it's stronger than the fucking dollar. I can tell you that much. Fair enough, fair enough. I mean, hey, I do it a bit more simplified, right? Like, one LMD is like a silver piece, you know? Ten LMDs is a gold piece. No, yeah, because I was thinking, like, in the game, where you need a million just to, like, put an operator through training. Are you not familiar with, <laughs> yeah. like, defense budgets, dude? Because, yeah, it costs, like, a fucking million. It actually does. <laughs> It's very expensive. LMD I mean, like, like, it, it, there's can a part be in Lone Trail one. where the president's talking about. Yeah, like, I, I, like, there's a part in Lone Trail where the president's talking about the military guys they, they, they lose. He's talking about like 10 million or something per guy to train them. Okay. Like, to train the so, people that they lost. Um, As you guys are, uh, you know, getting the money, he's like, but we did have a deal if you guys made it out alive, so. I guess, um, congratulations, you guys are now promoted to, uh, from junior scavengers to scavengers, and, uh, that comes with a bonus of, uh, 1k, so you'll be getting that too. I don't know if I should feel happy. No, actually, no, I don't feel happy. What the fuck? Well, anyhow, if that's the end for us... 1k is 100 gold, right, so Right, uh, Squark? Yes, it's 100 gold. Yeah, okay. So, uh... You know, well, if that's the end of the meeting, Slasher and I have a lunch date at a nice little restaurant. Wow, you're already out here stealing hearts? Sure. Ah, you know, just, you know, can't, can't resist gruesomely these four men, what can I say? <laughs> <laughs> what? That one stung. That's a ha ha ha! I'm gonna kill you in your sleep. <laughs> Perish the thought. Yeah, you know, um, just kind of like no shrugs, and uh, you guys leave. All right. Uh, so outside the door, as quietly as possible, uh, to tell um, we'll just say I'm gonna just lean in and tell either Emerald, yeah, Emerald or Blizzard, one of them, right? It's like, uh, um, yeah, yeah. You got to find a way to get him gone and stolen. In fact, I'm telling Emerald this, right? I'm sure you're familiar to hold uh, 
trifactor methods to make that happen. Not the dead kind, please. What? I I can't just disappear, people. She's with the kid there. Talk, to, talk it out with the rest of them while I talk to this one here. You know, you know what? All right, I'll see what I can do. Thank you. And uh, Slasher okay. and I are going to head out of the building. Okay, Slasher and you head out of the building. And uh, and we're all, like, you see, the, the rest of the A squad goes about their way. And um, so Emerald just goes up and it's like, all right, guys, so um, Sebus wants us to disappear that kid. Disappear as in kill? Or. I, I don't think so. Although I. You know, something tells me he wouldn't be too bummed out if that's what ended up happening. <laughs> um, but no, just somewhere that. I suppose, you know, a squad can't find it. Although I still don't understand how that's going to help us. They're going to, like, ask where the fuck the kid is tomorrow. Yeah. I don't know. Somewhere that they... We don't know the full scope. We don't know the connections. How do we know where they can't find? I guess maybe one of your guys' apartments? Well, I live in the slums, like the oh, absolute God. most uh, awful slums. No, you know what? No, no. They, they, may, they may already know your guys' residences. That might not work. Oh, that, yeah. um, that theater, right? Maybe one of the theater members' uh, houses, right? They shouldn't know that. Yeah, they shouldn't know that. I mean, look, at that, at that point, if they know that, we're already in a checkmate and it doesn't really fucking matter, so... That's... That's true. I didn't think this would be what I'd have to call in favors for, but... <laughs> Alright, so, uh... Life is great. Go to the theater and, uh, and I ask him? Yeah, I'll... I'll do that. Nice. Hey, how you want? Well, technically Seba owes you one, so ask it from him, not me. Yeah. I'll make sure to. And... By the way... Just between you all and me, I I find most of you at least relatively agreeable. I don't think Sebes particularly likes me. If if any of you know any anything about that, you know, I'd I'd, I'd be happy for any information to appear uh. perhaps more presentable. I don't think he particularly has an issue with you, if, it, if that helps. Um, I just think that people that he deems to be unreliable are uh, not exactly to his liking. Fair enough. I can see that. I did leave, after all. Yep. Looks like I have some questions to ask and some deals to make. He's kind of leaving. Well, good luck. And yeah, you guys uh, split up. And uh, now we're going to the final scenes of the session because yeah, we've been going for, on for a bit. Yeah, I got that going like five minutes. Okay, Chaser, we're starting with you. What's your final scene? <laughs> uh, fuck. Uh, uh... If you don't want to have one, you can also not have one. It's fine. Yeah, what's the context? It's just uh, my day. Your, your, your afternoon, I suppose, yeah. Yeah, you mentioned the theater and... Uh... I was there at the time, so I decided to head there. Wait, sorry, head where? To, to the theater. Oh, to the theater! Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we talked about it, and uh, yeah, I you, was you head there to the once, theater. so... Shit, the theater is also where Blizzard scene is gonna take place, you won't be there by then! <laughs> 
Gosh, darn you it. <laughs> you go to go to the theater, you get lost and distracted along the way. You have a wonderful night, of, uh, a day at the scene. Yeah, yeah, I get ADHD and distracted. <laughs> yep. <laughs> there we go. I was playing laser tag all day. Rogue gets distracted, so I was playing laser tag. Yeah, yeah, I, I started right, playing then. Subway Surfers and I got distracted. <laughs> Subway surfers, you started seeing Family Guy fucking like compilations. Hmm? Yeah, yeah. Stop talking. The theater is secretly the most. I mean, he, he will go to the theater later, just not for Blizzard's scene because he won't be yeah. here. Now, Kuroko. Well, I'll go then, people. Max, how's your yummy? All right. See you, Suba. So, yeah. so we're just chilling in the Ooh. afternoon. Yeah, it's up to you what you do. You can just oh, chill. By the way, that, and, that uh, layout works so well. We already got our paychecks. <laughs> what? We already have our monies? Yeah, we already got our money. Yeah, we have paid. Money. Okay. And uh, Neo is out of my jurisdiction now. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. You can go to the theater to, like, see him. Uh, no, I feel like that would... Everybody uh... be at this goddamn theater. <laughs> yeah, everyone be at this goddamn theater. I feel like that would this compromise... This is the most business they've gotten in a while. I feel like that would compromise uh, the plan to keep him under wrap, so... I think about it, going to visit him, but I decide to decline and just uh, go to the nearest fast food joint, Danny Missiles or something, uh, and just... Have some, have a burger, and have some actual nutritious food for once. That's not moldy bread. Yeah. And you have a, you have a lovely fucking dinner, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. Nice. All right. Now moving on to Blizzard. <laughs> uh. All right. Um. I, 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 I did ask you a question in DM Skorak. Uh. Oh, you did? Let me whoop! Yeah. I know you're very busy, man. I mean, so yeah. You can't always check. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, uh... I wouldn't say you have any specific knowledge, but... Uh, you wouldn't imagine no. Uh, okay. Well... I'm heading on over to the theater, Skorak. What am I seeing? You are seeing the theater. Uh, you see, like, um, at the point where you're Fair at, enough. they are preparing for today's performance. Um, you know, the journey of, of the of, of the Victorian soldier, Boost 16. <laughs> he truly uh, is the Bush 16. <laughs> Um, oh my god, that fucking reminds me of that, like, stupid, what was it? It's like, uh, it's like Rise of Kingdoms or something, The Legend 27. Reminds yeah. me of that fucking ad. <laughs> the Legend 27, yep. <laughs> Maybe, all this time through my journeys, I just needed a bush 15. <laughs> needed a bush, perhaps 16 of them. <laughs> and you go there, you see, like, the theater is a buzz, and uh, everyone's setting up, uh, you know, actors, uh, stagehands, everyone's good. And you see, like, Donna is, uh, is of course, playing the, the role of the of the love interest, you know, Bush 17. Uh, you know, it's it's very, very tragic story, you know, she, she dies about three quarters through. <laughs> uh, and, you know, everything seems good, everything seems fine. Um, you see, like, when you, uh, when you go in there, like, Ratchet kind of, like, you know, just greets you. It's like, oh, hey, dude. Uh, back faster than I expected you to be. Back faster than I expected. Um, uh, there did happen to be uh, a kid showing up here earlier today. What? Oh, yeah, the one Larissa, uh, like, um, dropped off, right? Yeah, he's, uh, he's over there. You can see, like, he's one of the front seats, just kind of, like, watching the rehearsals. Yeah. All right. Um... Ratchet, I need I need a favor. Huh? You will be compensated with top quality product at the best price I can give for you. Well, before you think I'm not going to give you anything, I need you to take care of that kid for me. If if need be, I will subsidize food, anything. But I need that okay. kid. Please, sir. 
I think we both know I am neither willing or able to take care of a kid. I figured, I figured as much, but at least very briefly. It would, you know would not be long. Look, why don't you ask Donna, right? She's like more responsible, yeah. better with kids, kinder, yeah. more good looking, absolute sweetheart. Um, all right, all right. <laughs> Settle down, <laughs> put it away, buddy. <laughs> got a got a <laughs> pile of atom on the back. Ah, uh, that that was gonna be my second. That was gonna be my second. Uh, my second choice. I just thought maybe maybe the deal would yeah. interest you. I appreciate that. I was your first choice. Oh, oh. enjoy the <laughs> enjoy the rest of your night. <laughs> enjoy the rest of your night. And he is gonna go over and kind yeah. of wait for Donna to have a moment. Yeah, you see Donna is kind of like, um, she's mostly like done with her rehearsal, she's mostly like coordinating the other actors, and it's like, no, no, you, you need to, you need to put the emphasis on the E, you know, like, like that, you know, just kind of do that, you know? Yeah. We're, 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 hey, you're, you're doing great, we're just gonna work on it for a bit. <sighs> you see she like has a towel like over her shoulders, uh, you know, yeah. currently has like a, like a t-shirt sleeveless and like, you know, fucking track pants, seems to have been like yeah. running around the stage a lot. <laughs> Yeah, and, 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 and Blizzard kind of, kind of, kind of gives her a little wave, a little kind of indication that he gets her attention. Hey, Blizzard, uh, you're back. Wow, that's uh, look, I'm very sorry, but we did give the role away. You know, it was it was today, so I, I don't think I can slot you back in. Oh, that's that's just fine. Actually, I need a different favor. Kind of, yeah, and and you know, trying you know, kind of, trying to kind of keep you know the biggest like winning smile he can, as he's as he's talking. You you know the kid who uh, who was dropped off earlier. Uh, yeah, yeah. I need you to, for a time, look after him. Oh, um. You know, no. It, no issues, right? I, I'll, I can, yeah. Um, why? You know, I, I'm sorry I, if it's too personal, but you know, if I am gonna be taking care of a kid, I, I'd like to at least know what's up. You know, the why is difficult because it could. <laughs> like well, Blizzard's like like he's 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 clearly like, like trying to like rack his brain for something to say and kind of like doing Look, hand movements until he eventually kind of almost throws his hands up and says, "These are it. We're we're friends, right? You can if you're in trouble, that's fine. I will I will help you. I just you can trust me. It just would endanger you potentially to know. Look, anything that endangers my actors." You know, I don't. I don't care if it endangers me too. What's going on? There's something. This job I have. We have to go. To. We. I think kind of, and kind of like again, he's, he's kind of pausing yeah, to where he just like he's he's like thinking through the most like simple explanation he can give for this. Yeah, it's the, it's the scavenging job, right? Like you you told me about yes. it. Blue form appraisals, right? Yeah. Yes. We found a kid there. We don't In know much about the kid. Yes, we don't know much about the kid. Could be very dangerous. And some people could be looking for the kid to potentially use for a dangerous, for something dangerous or potentially. It kind of like makes the like throat oh, oh. slashing. Oh dear. Uh, gee, Jesus, Lisa, what do you get yourself roped into? It's it's a long story, one that I can tell you. In fact, you know, when you're prepping scripts, actors, anything for the next, I'll, I'll make sure that whatever mission I accept, whatever one, if there's any option, I'll be there for the next performance. I can tell you all about I... it when we're preparing for it, but at the moment, I do need you to trust me on this. No, it's, it's okay. I trust you, Blizzard. It's... Okay, I'll I'll do it. Thank you. Just, you I'll, know, I'll subsidize stay safe anything there. that you need. Of course. No, it's and it's fine. You know, I, you know, the, the theater is not going to well, but, you know, uh, you know, the benefactor. You know, it's 
confined of course. Them financially. I I okay, well, I am very I, I'm very thankful like, to step up and like hugs you and it's like really though be, be safe okay I that that scary stuff you just told and she just you know pulls away. Absolutely, that bit. is the aim. Uh, okay. Um. Good luck. I should be. Yeah. Thank you. I should be back to do any rehearsal for anything you need within the next couple of days. See you then, and yeah. hopefully with more smiles, more acting less, well, less of whatever this is. Yeah, of course. I I've been thinking of actually, you know, setting up uh, the Tale of the Reverse Argonian. Mm -hmm. It is It is a classic. However, many have criticized its modern adaptations. Oh, you know, we're going full classic here. Mm -hmm. I Anyhow, respect that. Um, hey, you know, if you ever, if you want to, that leading role is yours. All right. And kind of going to, kind of, kind of, kind of briefly go, go, uh, kind of away from there, and then kind of take a seat next to, next to the kid. Mm -hmm. Yep. And you I'm will see, like, uh, you know, uh, the rehearsals. I. <laughs> I do have to ask you uh, one one little out of character question, Scott, because I, I have written down of, of my like notes from the first time we discussed that Donna isn't a naughty, but I think you said she was a vulpo. So I'll have to no, she's that, a, she's a vulpo. True. She's like a she's like a oh, fennec okay. vulpo, like with a very big ears. Hmm? Okay. Uh, also, what do, what what are your thoughts about murdering her? You know, what are your thoughts about about absolutely just sentencing this sweet little girl to death? <laughs> I sure hope it won't come to that. <laughs> That's why I was honestly hoping to fight Ratchet first and see if maybe paying him would do the trick. Oh my god, you're like, you want to fucking push Ratchet under the bus? <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, Ratchet's oh. cool and all, but I don't need him as much. Damn. Uh, and and so he <clears throat> he he is kind of go gonna be kind of next to next to the kid kind of and and just you know give him kind of a like brief quiet explanation of the situation like you know go you know go with the nice Volpo lady there shouldn't be any there shouldn't be any reason they can find you and if like if people are in the if, if people that you that you don't know of are like in there for any reason find somewhere to like be quiet try to hide try to stay out of sight essentially. You see, he nods. The guy like scribbles down on his notebook. Why is he doing this? Why? It's. I I don't I can't fully say what's going on inside her head, but I should try to give you. Given I'm asking you into a strange scenario, I should give you the best answer I can. I think it is that she wants to keep me around. This theater has struggled and continued to struggle, but ever you since I've like, been here, it has been better. Kind of scribbles. Least. Yes, that's what I mean. The theater. She oh. is good. Very good. She is... She's the type of person who doesn't want any kind of creative control on her work. She despises any of the sanitized, watered-down nature of Rankwood or a bigger theater. This is hers. It is fully independent. She can do what she wants with it. Only people breathing down her neck are bankers making sure they get their money on time. I would say hmm. that if I were in her shoes, it would probably be a better idea to try to make it big. I think she has the talent. I think she's good with people. I think people want to work with her. But at the end of the day, it's her choice. I like that, I think. 
It is a noble goal. You see, he nods and seems to be, you know, receptive to this. Yeah. yeah. And he, he like, Blizzard himself is is, is, is kind of looking up, thinking about that statement. Like, it's a, it's a noble goal, kind of with a smile on it. Yeah, he, and he gets a small smile. It's not like a smirk or anything. It's kind of like a genuine... Mm. It's a genuine expression of emotion. He's just... And, and he kind of quietly says... I hope my goals are that noble. I hope the results will be that way too. With that, we are going on to the last scene. Uh. Oh, Sebus, you got a date! <laughs> and with the most beautiful uh, um, girl at the before, ball. Before, before, well, yep. before you guys step, step oh, out, uh, uh, before, uh, before you guys start, I, I, I'm, I'm going to... I'm gonna have to step out. It's 3.30 for me. I have not eaten breakfast or anything. I am so fucking hungry. I should have prepared better. All right, all good. But no worries, no worries. We are, we are like fucking will... dropping out. We're like, hey, scene over, <laughs> boop, scene over, boop. <laughs> I, 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 will, I, I, will, I will make sure to watch this back. I won't miss it. You know, it, it, won't, it won't go to waste for no me worries. and everything. No worries, yeah. no worries. Thank you for, thank you for being here. Right. Thank you for, for participating. What does what uh, Supus we'll usually say? Max week. out your gummy, max out your Dorothy. Yep. There we go. All right. And now. Well, she's going to follow you, like wherever you, you oh, want yeah, to go. Oh, yeah, we're going to go to a, a nice place. Nice enough. Mm hmm. I have a sit down. Got it. Like, yep. Order whatever, and then I'll just uh, start chatting. She, you she like... orders a lot. She 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 eat good. <laughs> well, it is on my dime. So, uh, you seem like the type of person that likes to seek enjoyment out of life, a fun, right? Which is why you yeah, you could say that. Let earlier today slide for us. More or less. Mm. Would you be interested in something be... really uh... interesting? Didn't think you'd be uh, self-aware enough to notice when someone has seen through your lies. Well, I'm a pretty good judge of character. I can tell when sometimes some of the things I'm spinning just don't really land. Mm, respectable. So, if you're interested in having fun and seeing really interesting things, I have a proposition. Nothing bad. Nothing that's going to really cost you anything. Give us a slight hand. I'll tell you everything, and boy, is it juicy. Hmm. Okay, so... Essentially, you want me to, um... Betray the company I've been working with for uh, a better part of a decade now. Uh, less correct? a betrayal and more of a... Fun joke and pulling one over on them. In your decade of working here, oh. have you ever pull, put one over on the company? Of course, and I imagine your intentions are simply to have fun and, uh, you know, just pull their leg a little bit. Actually, not far from the truth whatsoever. Mm. Is it now? Well, I like to have information. I like to see where things go first. I'm not saying this little secret of ours is going to stay a secret. But I need to know exactly what's going on here. Because at the moment, I have no clue. Hmm. Yeah, you See, can uh, me for Mr. Being Noel, a little bit of a, of a thing about me. I don't really believe in allegiances. I believe in convenience. And in having fun. My only allegiance is to the man that saved me about... Nah, nah, how long has it been? Eh, unimportant. So? The ball's in your court, I suppose. Is that man... Convince me. Is that man in this equation? With hmm. Bluethorn, that is. I don't think so. He's, uh... Busy these days. Then I'd say 
You're not going against your allegiance to him. And this might be some of the most fun you've seen in a long time. I am but a performer, after all. What would I do if I let down the audience? And uh, do we have a specific screenplay for this performance, or are we flying by the seat of our pants? No, I've always liked flying by the seat of my pants. I've always enjoyed improv. I mm. find it to be a very useful skill. It makes the show more lively, interesting, interactive. Right, so... What do you want me to do, exactly? Well... Put the kid at a place. We're gonna look into it. Now, I have no clue about the kid's whereabouts. In fact, since we had to have that meeting, because it was forced on us, as you so graciously told us, uh, we all technically haven't seen the kid since we dropped him off, nor do we know if he's still there. Now, someone of your insight, though. I know you know. So what I'm hoping for is... You help us make sure people don't know. You know? Mm. Well... So, this is all just about hiding the kid. For the time being, yes. I'll tell you exactly what the kid I is. Mean... To be fair, we don't really know what the kid is. I mean, I figured. If you did, you wouldn't really just send him away. You know, that's just... You know, that's uh, the... Actually, sending him away could have also been... Yeah, sending him away could have also been a huge favorite. Bluethorn. That's still... out there. Hmm. Really? Well, the kid is the reason why the... that Ramiel guy just poofed. Imagine yeah, we that, take him... I, I never understood why they didn't send us to take care of him. Huh. Neither do I. I rose a big stink about it, but... at least we're back alive. There's something that the company isn't telling either of us. I'd like to know. But it might, might have to be a conversation for another time. First, we need to put out the fires they come up. I mean, hey. Just think of it this Jezebel way, If Jezebel gets everything she wants, things get boring, so... Yeah, and... I suppose I'm somewhat on board. Excellent. Oh, also, uh... On day one, after orientation, uh... You have a nice little stare of my conversations? I don't know what you're talking about. There can only really be one other person here. No, she kind of like shrugs. Oh, well, I hope it was an interesting play. Yeah. Definitely not a play of someone that wants to uh, have a bit of fun. Getting to know people is part of the fun. Hmm. Only if the play is a tragedy. We'll still out. Ball's still in your court. It can be anything we want it to be. And, uh, you know, well, I guess the, the food will arrive by that point. Yep. Kind of like to start seating. Well, about the, the kid and hiding it. I'm uh, afraid I'll have to disappoint you there. I'm not exactly sure where it is either, you know. I don't I don't have telepathy or anything. Um but I mean I'm definitely not gonna rat you out. Well if that's anything. They send you to assist in helping with the search. You can definitely help us out a little extra there. Especially since you seem to be one of the more insightful people here at this company. Now, we're not gonna get off scot free by just saying we lost the kid. Oh no. We're going to be asking everyone at that theater and noting, noticing, or I, I, I know that uh, uh, that Dense Bear most likely didn't tell them to make up a story or something to cover our asses or their asses. So regardless, 
We'll need your help. Mm. Hey, the time I'll being. definitely, uh... I'll definitely be playing ball. You know, no skin off my back, I suppose. Worst thing that'll happen is, hey, Jezebel is mad at me, but... Eh, we both know she can't replace me. I am a little bit worried if, uh... Corner the kid too much. Not you, but people corner the kid too much. He might also make him go away. Oh. So. Really? Yeah. He's that, got uh, uh, that sort of capability. Uh, imagine that, but the base of operations. Like I said, we're potentially doing them a favor or doing ourselves a favor. Either way, I see it mm. as a win-win. Yeah. Anyhow, glad to, you know to have you as, uh, what's up? The kid has to go. It has to go? Too big of a variable. Well, I'm not gonna... Erasing people out of existence like that. You I'm may not be going to encourage God. you, nor dissuade you, but I will advise against it. That's all. Take a sip of my coffee. Just a thought. No. Well, thoughts are fine until they really implant themselves, aren't they? Ideas become ideologies. I've had my brush with a fair share of those. They only matter if they can be put into action. I think Jezebel's can be put into action? Jezebel's ideology is... somewhat plain, really. How so? I don't think she is much more than she appears to be. You know, just a woman trying to make her way in the world. Then again, it's so like Jezebel is running the show, not really. That would be... Who do you think? I'm pretty sure you've got an idea. I have an idea. Again, ideas are just ideas. <laughs> I guess they are. But you have bought me a nice dinner, and you have bought my, uh, my tempor uh, temporary cooperation. I don't know if your wit and... Uh, pretty face can really buy you much more at this particular point. I saying I'm not good enough to be your dance partner? Hurt. Oh. Don't be. My standards can be rather unreasonable. I hope with this cooperation you can see that uh, I can meet, you, you know, uh, meet your standards one day. For now, let me entertain well, you. Guess only time will tell. Did. So, now that we both know we won't be killing each other today, wanna have a normal conversation? <laughs> Toast. A, a temporary friendship. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Clink. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, I think, um, you know, do you actually, like, engage with her, like, in a normal, like, Yeah, you know, yeah. Well, just, just talk about yeah. how much I hate the sand. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I don't know how much it you is. hate sand. How coarse <laughs> and hot it is. <laughs> okay, you know, let me, let me roll a d20 to see how pleasant of, of one evening it was for her. Hmm? Okay. Let's see, like, let's roll affinity check. <laughs> okay, you know what? I will say... The dice said nine, but you did play it pretty well, so the result will be positive overall. Sweet. All right, Next. well, that, I'm assuming that is the end. That, that is the end. With that, we have finished another day and another session of Harmacist Sea Squad. And yep, uh, the plot uh, thickens. The plot fucking thickens. <laughs> I got a soda. I'm happy. God. Yeah, Stop. Kuragi. <laughs>
I was about to thank you for sneaking around till the end, and then you just have to fucking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, sir. Anyhow, for those of you that stayed with us until the end, uh, both in the audience and in the players, thank you very much, and uh, we will be seeing you all next week. Yeah. Uh, anything uh... you guys want? Uh, no, no, just, uh, you know, Ooh, go rewatch Harm Assist and, uh, you know, listen to Isaac Wolf music while you do it. Yeah, go rewatch Harm Assist, get, get, catch all these references. <laughs> play Blue Archive, play Don't. Gotcha Games, Don't. develop a gambling addiction. Don't do that. <laughs> it's fun. All right, well, we'll be seeing you guys later. Bye. Uh, goodbye. Jeanne.